So we'd have to spend two supplies or a hole to move the ship off this space. Otherwise, I think we just go around in circles here. Mm. My hole is big. <laughs> <laughs> I robust, don't mind. It's very, robust very and strong, robust firm, hull. and strong and stable hull. <laughs> so, if you want to, if you want to have a little bit of my hull, you can have a little, you can have a little bit. You got to ask nicely. You want, you want, give me thirty minutes <laughs> in the bar. <laughs> Hello, I'm Laurie from No Rolls Bard, and welcome to Board Game Club, where the first rule of Board Game Club is... Why is rum gone? Every week we gather a group of our friends here in the NRB studio to show you just how much fun board gaming can be. And this week we are playing Forgotten Waters, designed by Mr. Bistro, J. Arthur Ellis and Isaac Vega, and published by Plaid Hat Games. Now, Forgotten Waters cast players as the crew of a pirate ship sailing the seven seas, represented by this little board, and journeying to various deserted islands, pirate towns, and boarding all manner of other vessels, all of which are found in this location book. Did I mention yet yeah, that we have a brand new TTRPG channel called Chaotic Neutral? No, I didn't. Well, I have done now, so check that out in the description down below for an exclusive episode of us playing Fiasco. Back to Forgotten Waters, it's split into scenarios which you can play through and you can save over multiple sessions. You'll unlock new story for your characters and upgrade their skills. We'll be doing some of the starting one for the purposes of this video, and it all runs off this app. Players will be taking on the role of one of this motley crew of bumbling buccaneers and they'll take one of these sheets which give them some sort of character fluff thanks to a series of Mad Lib style prompts on the inside and tracks their skills at the bottom here which in turn unlocks spots on this constellation which is essentially how you're going to level up and eventually win the game. Every player will also have a role on the ship. There's the ship scribe who writes down important information in the ship's log. You've got the quartermaster who keeps track of everyone's infamy, which dictates the turn order. And the first mate who keeps track of the crew and their discontent. Should these two markers ever meet, it's game over because your crew has mutinied. The bosun keeps track of the ship's hull. If this tracker ever reaches zero, game over. Your ship has sunk. You've got the Cooper, who keeps track of supplies, which you can use to keep the crew happy. You can also use it to do other things during the game. You've got the Gunner, who mans the cannons, loading and unloading them, ideally into other vessels. And the Lookout, who monitors threats and the current objectives. You basically divvy them out, one to each player, with some players doubling up on rolls. Now, the actual moment-to-moment -moment gameplay is very, very simple. Players will basically be travelling through these different tiles on the ocean. They'll then be putting the number written on the tile, 953, into the app. They'll then get a bit of piratey flavour like, Oh no! Everyone has scurvy! Or something much better than that. And then players will flip to the relevant page in the location book. And this is where the round rules come into play. Because during a round, players resolve three phases. You have the planning phase, the action phase, and the end of the round phase. Now, during the planning phase, players have a limited amount of time to decide what they are going to do at their location in infamy order, which is, again, tracked here by your quartermaster. The player at the top goes first, and then you work your way down. All they've got to do is they take their standee and they plonk it on one of these spaces in the book. Green spaces can have multiple pirates do them in a round. Blue spaces, only one pirate can do in a round. And red spaces, one pirate must do in a round. Once everyone has decided what they're going to do, you resolve the actions working down this order. This is what's called the action phase. Now, some actions might see us inputting new numbers into the app to get more story or adjusting our supplies or our hull or our crew or finding treasure in this deck, which generally gets you bonus points to some of your skill checks or generally doing a skill check, which has you roll your character's personal D12. You then add your ability score modifier from your character sheet and then different results do different things, usually with a bit of story attached. It's all very, very easy to do, and it will always tell you exactly what you're supposed to be doing. It's idiot-proof. 
And then finally, for the end of the round phase, you read the section that is printed at the bottom of the location book, which might see you gear up for another round of combat, decide whether you want to set off from the island you're visiting, or decide if you want to sail into unknown waters. Pretty dangerous. At which point you probably plug some more numbers into the app, and then you flip to a new page in the book, and then you do it all again. It's that damn simple. You win if you manage to complete the scenario by following the story all the way through, and you lose if your ship sinks, or your crew mutinies, or if we reach the final threat event on this tracker, or in some specific scenarios, you instantly lose if you do something bad, like meet this ship over here in this scenario. You don't want to meet that ship. So who is going to be a Jolly Roger, and who is going to be a sad Roger? Scurvy. Find out as we play Forgotten Waters. Joining me for this episode of Board Game Club, I'm joined by Lorna. Hi. I'm joined by Dom. Ah. Thank you for committing, Lorna. <laughs> Thank you for committing to the bit. I'm joined by Blair. Yar! And Ellen from Ox Venture is here! We are playing Forgotten Waters. <laughs> Hello. Hi. I'm polite. I'm polite. <laughs> the polite pirate. <laughs> Excuse me, do you mind if we board your vessel? <laughs> Good day. <laughs> Good day. <laughs> we're playing Forgotten Waters, which is a little bit of a role-playing game, but it's also a game where we're going to be exploring this map and trying to find our way to this island. It's a campaign game, but we're playing the opening scenario. Uh, we'll be doing different jobs on the ship. Some of us are the first mate, some of us are the quartermaster, who's in charge of everyone's infamy. Blair, you are the- Cooper. Cooper, who's in charge of all the food. Dom is the gunner, who took all the guns. Bang, bang. Because <laughs> we were confident. <laughs> Lorna, you are the boatswain. Bosun. The bosun. The bosun. I look after the the, the hull, <laughs> which is what I thought you said when you offered it up, but it, you, you said hull. That's why you, that's why you snapped it as green. Oh, yes, I please. look after the hull. <laughs> Let's go around and find out who we're playing, and starting with Lorna. So my name is Cigarettes, because <laughs> I'm a naughty pirate. Um, this is my backstory. The rest of oh, the crew might think me mad, but I know what I saw. It was early in the morning and I was alone on the deck when I heard what I thought was the cry of a horse <laughs> coming from the sea. I went to the railing and there I saw it, the most beautiful creature I'd ever seen. Skin glistening with a silver blue shine and each eye was bigger than an orange as, and as beautiful as the stars. <laughs> I knew right away this was one of oh, the merfolk. It seemed to be caught in a fishing net. <laughs> <laughs> Grub, <laughs> Grub had left cast out and the mer looked to be struggling to get free. But I've got more words that aren't on here. Oh no. <laughs> Will they come up at another point? I imagine so. I quickly cut the fair creature from the net. They looked deeply into me eyes. Then with a gracious <laughs> smile and a peck on the cheek, they swam away. I was instantly smitten, and try as I might, I just can't shake them from my mind. I've tried the only course of action is to follow my heart and do whatever it takes to locate my one true love. Not another NRB member with a thing for horses. <laughs> oh no. Oh, oh God. God. Join the <laughs> I am obviously Dr. Skullface. <laughs> Great. Master debater. Um, <laughs> yes. uh, I was the smart one in my family, and they scraped together enough coin to send me to Boise Boy Bo Brown Academy of Horse Esperanto. <laughs> <laughs> so as I could earn a degree in Tyromancy, which is the divination of future by coagulation of cheese. But I refused. It wasn't that I didn't want an education, but I'm a born contrarian. So I argued they were better off giving it to Terry de Toulouse. <laughs> what? The empty headed wench who worked down at the Groggy Gecko. Oh my gosh! <laughs> I get you for this, Dom. <laughs> you have to catch us first, Terry. <laughs> <laughs> Sadly, they did just that, then told me to shove off. Unsure of what to do with myself, I decided to join my old friend, Cigarettes, <laughs> who had just signed up with a pirate ship. Life aboard the ship was difficult at first, as following orders wasn't exactly my strong suit. But after a couple stints in the brig, 
being lashed to the mast in a most unpleasant keel hauling, I learned to hold me quarrelsome tongue. Indeed, I eventually became a well-respected member of the crew, and cigarettes and I left for better paying jobs aboard a new ship. Controlling my thirst for debate ain't easy, and when I do get the chance to let it out, I tend to go a little too far. Cigarette says it's because I'm a natural ass. <laughs> Wink. <laughs> Me, made entirely of bones. Um, but I like to think somewhere in the world there's a job for someone good at arguing like I am. Very nice. Uh, I'm playing as Rear Admiral Cheeks. <laughs> Exploring the world has always been my passion. In my youth, I was a travel agent and volunteered for every exploratory <laughs> edition I could find. After a time, I found myself aboard the ship of Captain Marshall Tugboat, the fearless royal explorer who became my mentor. I learned much on his vessel as we traveled the seas, but eventually luck ran out and our vessel was sunk by a giant albatross. Oh, no. The captain perished and it was time to find a new vessel to sign up with. When I heard a pirate captain was going to sail past the ocean's edge, I realized the world was about to become an even more interesting place and pirates might very well hold the key to the thrills of exploration. Now I find myself on a pirate ship and am forced to confront the fact that I hate pirates. I hate their unwashed bodies, their complete disregard for the king's tongue, not to mention their ridiculous oh. obsession with shiny Charizard Pokemon cards. <laughs> their very presence soils what should be a transformative journey of self-discovery. Take Grub, for example. Who could stand to be around this lout for even five minutes? God <laughs> damned pirates. <laughs> I thought we were friends. <laughs> 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 and who are you? Hi. <laughs> um, I am Rose from the Waves. Very good. Ah. Very good. Ah. A survivor pirate, so that's why, yeah. Uh, <clears throat> hello, uh, <laughs> this is my backstory. The already chewed gum. That's what the royals called my homeland. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> it was a place of hard beauty where warriors were born, living and dying by sword and axe. But despite their prowess, my people fell when Captain Gnarly Jack brought the Royal Navy to our shores. The royals used cat biscuits on my people <laughs> for no reason other than they knew they could. In the end, no one survived. <laughs> Except me, born again in the flaming ruin of all I knew and loved. So my biscuits. ship's cat biscuit was dead. My modest barbarian home insured. What is it? Sorry, What's my characters yet? always have dead cats in their background. I'm really sorry. <laughs> My modest barbarian home insurance business was bankrupted. My left hand was naught but a bloody stump after being cat biscuits by a royal soldier. <laughs> they, want me, they want me to turn it into an adjective. Okay. And I bellowed into the frozen night up at the uncaring stars that sat in the black sky, placed there by uncaring gods. Lost and adrift in a world I no longer knew, I wandered for years until joining a pirate crew that valued my mar martial prowess. Now I am the last survivor of the already chewed gum, and I will see that Captain Gnarly Jack pays in blood. Oh, oh. All right. Time to find out what's going on with this guy. I'm Grub. <laughs> I'm the culinary pirate. So I don't know what's going on over here. I thought you liked my food. I make you nice food, don't I? No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I haven't seen a vegetable in weeks. <laughs> it's because they've all gone off. Uh, I was known throughout the lands as one of the greatest chefs to ever grace a kitchen. Wealthy nobles from around the world would pay for my passage to their courts in order to bless their palates with my talents. <laughs> From my smoked scallop and olive pate to my <laughs> onion and ox heart fricassee. <laughs> I don't think that's how you say that word. Uh, and even my giant squid and cream sorbet. My dishes were the talk of the town. Sadly, on my last trip to a distant land, we were beset by pirates. They flew the flag of the dreaded cat and they quickly put me in chains and declared that I was the new ship's cook. I tried everything I could to escape. I tried to pick the lock on my chains. I routinely undercooked, undercooked dishes of roasted seagull <laughs> to try and poison the crew. 
Eventually, I proved to be too much of a trouble and they dumped me with a rival ship. Life aboard other ship. Life aboard the other <laughs> ship. <laughs> <laughs> Has actually been pretty good. I'm not in change. The captain is kind. And the crew is surprisingly polite and jovial. So polite. <laughs> but their cook is a drooling half-wit. I wonder if I can set fire to the ship and escape the next time we're at port. Oh, that would be really nice. Yeah, yeah I know. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so this scenario is called Beyond the Ocean's Edge. We have an app to track it, which will tell us bits of story as we go. Uh, but this is the introductory bit of story. Long ago, people spoke of a land called Sunset. A place full of honourable merfolk, <gasps> powerful witches, towering monsters, and legendary pirates. A world that stretched so far and wide that not even the royal monts could claim dominion over it. But as the years passed and the world twisted, the legend of Sunset faded and most forgot about its wonder. Most except Captain Jesbert J. Vance. He never for a moment questioned that Sunset was real and spent his life searching for it. Now an old man, he has decided to set off on one last adventure to find the fabled waters of Sunset and has convinced you to join him. Your quest begins in search of the fabled Clearing Stone. Captain Vance is convinced it is the key to getting into Sunset. You've struck some luck in acquiring a map that should lead you to the stone, but none of you can understand it in its entirety. Because of this, you sail to Precipice Island, where an old friend of the captain may be able to decipher the map. The quest seems easy enough, but Captain Vance's previous adventures have made him some enemies, most notable of which is the Royal Mont family, who have hired the notorious Captain Razor to Ooh. hunt you down. Oh dear. So we begin the first round on page 19, which is this, this oh, yeah. port, which is, uh, where is this place? Portland, that's where I'm from. Portland. <laughs> <laughs> Precipice nice Island. Oregonia. <laughs> oh, Oregonia, Portland. So what we're going to do is, <laughs> we don't do it now, but we're going to do it in a second. Because you are the bosun, you are in charge of the timer. Oh. Um, so Welcome to me. the ship. Here's your iPad. Okay. <laughs> we're not gonna, yeah, we're not gonna. That's the crew manager. Need an iPad? No, no, no. <laughs> the iPad. <laughs> <laughs> it's not healthy. <laughs> so what we do uh, when we reach a destination, we're gonna sail uh, sail throughout the game, discover new locations, and visit them, and we'll flip through different pages of the book and do stuff there. But what we're gonna do when we're in a location is we have the time on the timer, which we'll not activate now, but it's 40 seconds for this one, um, to basically choose what we're going to do while we're at this place. Uh, in these ranked things, you can have um, green ones, which a, a multiple number of people can do. Um, when they're there, you can do blue ones, which only one person on the crew can do. And there are red ones, which somebody has to do. Mm. Um, they're they're <clears throat> crucial to the mission. We do them in infamy order. Which is Ellen's job as the quartermaster. So should we find out what the infamy order yeah, is? Yeah, so we have our tokens here. Should we go from lowest to highest? Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, no. So sadly, at the bottom we have. Oh. oh. I'm sorry. Oh, no. I'm sorry, but. How can I not be infamous? I'm, I've got a skull for a face. <laughs> it's pretty regular. Pretty, pretty regular. Pretty, pretty normal. Pretty, 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 pretty normal as pirates go. <laughs> well, as the debating skills need to come up again, I think. Uh, next one. <laughs> No! Oh, I'm so oh, sorry. It's That's grub. Fine. So it's sorry, fine. Grub. I've only been a pirate for like a month, so it's yeah. just okay. Okay. Third is. We have. Is that me? Cigarettes. Yeah. Cigarettes. Cigarettes. That checks out. And then. <laughs> second is. Oh! oh the first mate, second in infamy. Oh. <laughs> Outrageous! I promise I didn't look. Incredible. I think it's rigged. I yeah, think and then uh, shuffle uh, things. Uh, Ring shuffle. Do you know what? Yeah. You get invited on the show, and the first thing you do is cheat. <laughs> so okay. watch the videos or something. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> so what we're going to do is we're going to start the timer in a second, um, and then everyone has to, in that time, in infamy order, place their standee on this book on one of these things. Obviously, blue ones only one person can do. Uh, green ones, multiple people can do. You get a kind of idea of what might happen 
um, by these little symbols, but we will read them out as we go uh, once we the time is up. Um, the issue is, if no, if we don't manage to all place our standees in that 40 seconds, uh, we gain some discontent <gasps> on this little oh. first mate tracker here. If this little sword token ever reaches this little pirate face token, we lose the game. A couple of other ways we can lose the game. If our ship's hull ever reaches zero, we can lose the game. And I believe if we ever run out of supplies, we can also lose the game. And in this specific scenario, there is another way to lose the game. Because we are trying to get to this location here, 963. If we ever end up having to read the entry for 962, this ship here, we also lose the game. So, have a quick look in infamy order. Think about what you might want to do. Uh, How does it relate to this? The star, the star is 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 this, or we can. Or star is probably your constellation. Star is your constellation. Right. So if you bury treasure, you can bury the treasure from your hand. We all have a bit of treasure, which we yeah. might as well talk about in a second. Mm. But you can bury treasure, um, which is means you can't use it again. But you gain one of your constellation. Ah, uh, right. And your constellation so, is how you personally win the game mm. um, by filling out four of your bits of constellation at different points throughout this scenario. Um, we will be asked to fill them out and they will change bits about our character. If you get four of them, you get a good ending. And the other way to get them is by doing these jobs. These yes, different. exactly. So you'll gain, you, you will gain uh, points in that. And then if you fill in one with the star, you get to fill in a bit of your constellation. Great. So Can having you run a think us about through that. really quickly, like the different symbols? Absolutely. So, yeah. so in the uh, market, mm -hmm. uh, you can gain swagger. Mm -hmm. Important for a pirate. Um, we can seemingly gain supplies as well. You can gain a re-roll. Uh, there's treasure, there's danger, and there's also mystery uh, at the abandoned houses. So you can gain one exploration, you can gain a re-roll, you can gain treasure or mystery. Uh, in this one, you can gain brawn. Uh, we can adjust the content of the crew on the crew track or mystery. Psychic shanty is just pure mystery. Uh, danger, something to do with the ship. Uh, probably repairing the hull, um, supplies, navigation, which is important because we can find out where we're going. It's quite dangerous to move along here without necessarily knowing which tiles we're going to uncover as they're all face down at the moment. Uh, or treasure. Mystery in the captain's mission and burying treasure gains you part of your constellation. So, Lorna, do you want to start off the timer? <laughs> Yar. Yar. Ellen first. Okay, um, I'm going to go for the tipsy tortoise because I'm quite high on the brawn. Very so good. I'm, go I'm the first mate. I'm going to do the captain's mission. Now it's Lorna. Um, can I do the, the mystery shanty thing? Is that a terrible idea? I'm you can go totally go do the psychic shanty. You can find out. That's what, me. Yeah, it's I'm going to go here. And I'm going to abandon the houses. <gasps> Great, we've done it. Okay. Done. Why is that so stressful? <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't give you much time. We've now all chosen what we're going to be doing at port, starting. We're done. Dr. Skullface. Dr. Skullface. Dr. Skullface. <laughs> we went to the abandoned houses, which means you get to gain one in exploration. So you get oh. to fill in a notch on that. Ooh. Which gives me a star. Does that mean it goes straight on yeah, my that means you can fill in your constellation. Oh my goodness. On your constellation, you can only fill in next to where you already have a filled in space mm. or into the star in the center. Well, if I go this way, it's four each time. If I go this way, it's three each time, and I'm no fool. <laughs> <laughs> this way. More prizes. So then what you do is you're going to perform an exploration check, which means you're going to roll this die. Here we go. Let's have a look at these abandoned houses. See what the real estate value is. 12. Oh. 12. On a 12. Treasure. You get plus two treasures. Plus two. two treasures. Give me, give me. Holy cow. So one, two. With that said, we might as well go around and say what treasures what we all treasures have, because we, we all do have treasures. We mm. all got given one at the beginning of the game. Lorna, why don't you start? Um, I've, I've got a fake beard. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, and it says discard to discard all of your misfortune Ooh, tokens good. and gain a re-roll. Great. Oh. So uh, these are re-roll. Oh, this is, that's it. You gain a re-roll token, which is these, which you can use to re-roll your die. Obviously, misfortune mm -hmm. token is basically the same as having disadvantage in D&D. Uh. You roll the dice twice. You have to roll the dice twice the next time you do an ability check. And you have to take the lowest result. Yeah. So you've gained two treasures. Uh, what have you got, Dom? So I started with a loudmouth parrot. Great. Uh, which I call uh, Sullivan. <laughs> <laughs> uh, when you gain one or more infamy, gain an additional infamy. Ooh. The loudmouth parrot cannot be buried. <laughs> <laughs> and then it gives me plus one 
Uh, this one's swagger <laughs> pussy. I'm trying to bury something for years. And it just won't, it won't stick. Oh, um, plus one swagger, plus one hunting. What, what, well, I imagine it was like a Yago. Is that when you trade <laughs> um, or something? You, no, you keep that forever. So when you've got that equipped, you get plus one to those stats. You don't get to fill it in, but you oh, get right. to keep it. It's basically like an, an additional modifier. Oh, if it ever so gets checked. Yes, exactly. Yeah, I'm right with you, with you. Um, great. Okay, so there's that. Um, <laughs> the Landmass Parrot. I've, got, uh, I've just gained exquisite charts with 62% oh. fewer blood smears. <laughs> That's plus one swagger, nice. plus one explore, uh, plus one navigation. And I've got waterproof boots, oh. ugly but functional, just like you. Um, Whoa. Plus one. Um, rude. <laughs> plus one A. That's so rude. rude. Well, I thought we were <laughs> polite pirates. <laughs> Not me. Not you. I, I, I need to. I need to get my rep up. This is it. <laughs> He's forcing debates wherever it's happening. Yeah. 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 You disagree with me? Debate me. <laughs> Debate me in the do comments. It. Do it. <laughs> Don't ask them to do that. They will do that. Um, I only have one of their treasure, but I've got a stunt dog. Uh, when I'm performing a skill check, I can add one to my result. What's your stunt, stunt dog's name? Sparky. Sparky. Can I clarify Sparky what a stunt dog, dog is like? Like on Britain's Got Talent, how they have the dancing dog. Yeah, I, it's that's like, what it's, I'm imagining. Yeah, it's like yeah, it's a crafts thing. I think I'm sort of I'm sort of trying to get together a pirate craft. <laughs> <laughs> Starting I with would Sparky. Watch the shit yeah. Out of that. <laughs> 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 it's really hard to watch because the ships are moving the whole time. <laughs> <laughs> it's that much more. Yeah, it doesn't make good TV. <laughs> what treasure have you got, Ellen? I've got a love letter. Oh. <gasps> oh. <laughs> My God, cigarettes is so wow. jealous. <laughs> <laughs> uh, when burying this card, uh, crew goes down by minus one and discontent by minus one. Oh. So I can basically bring those both down. No, oh, that's good. Interesting, okay. Um, I've got a fake gun. Uh, <laughs> you weren't allowed a cool. real one. I wasn't allowed <laughs> a real one. Uh, when you gain one or more aim, you may steal a treasure from another player. Give me your treasure. Not now, but what? at some point. <laughs> <laughs> That's a fake gun. You just told us it's a fake gun. <laughs> work on you don't, you know. don't know that. <laughs> you don't know. You haven't got eyes in those sockets. I could swap it out with a real problems. one. You don't know. Their infamy is higher than yours. Yeah. Fear me. Infamous for carrying around a fake gun. Yeah. <laughs> so scary. <laughs> All right. Okay. Uh, Rose from the waves. Mm -hmm. You are at the tipsy tortoise. Mm -hmm. And you get to intimidate the barkeep. Uh, you gain, <laughs> we get crew plus one. Okay. So we go up to 10, which is very Whoa. good. Uh, and plus one brawn. Great. And cool. then we're going to perform a brawn Let's check. I'm going to brawn check. check. <laughs> <laughs> I really like that. <laughs> I fail these at the gym a lot. So. Oh, no. All right. Eight. Eight. Okay, not bad. Plus not your brawn. So you've got my one modifier in brawn. One so in you've brawn. got nine. Okay. Uh, which is. Going to give you. Ooh, interesting. <clears throat> May I have the iPad, please? Oh. <laughs> Yarn. Yars. Thank you. Good job. <laughs> hey. They're Three. learning. <laughs> it's good to be supportive. Do you have any of those treats? Oh. Thank you. <laughs> okay. So. Good cigarettes. <laughs> good, <job. laughs> good cigarettes. I want you to answer some questions for me. Mm. You growl at the barkeep. Oh, that's oh, you. I'm intimidated. Sure, Sorry, I'm she says. The answer to each of them is no. Now watch your mouth, you snap. Watch your own, she growls. And with that, the two of you lock in a passionate embrace. Oh. A half hour later, you stumble out of the tipsy tortoise <laughs> and head back to the ship. Oh, Did you learn spicy. anything? A peer yeah. asked when you return. Oh I got God. no answers, you admit. Just a new fiance what? and the need for a bath. Oh my oh, 30 oh, oh god, give her the so, last bit. Like ten goes. You gain, oh, you, gain you gain a reroll. <laughs> <laughs> and we are going to lock action three because she's tired. Oh, <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh no. Cigarettes, how do you oh, feel shit. that someone's much luckier in love than you? Oh, <laughs> you I've got a love back. letter, I've just, just got a fiance. <laughs> My whole there identity. You are pining for this seahorse. <laughs> <laughs> Incredible. Um, hey, good job. Well, Thanks. okay, so you are at the psychic shanty. Uh, you get to roll a die. Thank you. Oh boy. Thank you. <laughs> well, that's cheating. <laughs> 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 
Why, why isn't it rolling? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't like that one. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Three. Three. <laughs> a noble three. three. Oh, good. We need the iPad again. <laughs> yeah. Oh. <laughs> Dobby Wombles, do you want to read that? Sure. Um, <clears throat> I see you choking to death on a tuna sandwich, says the psychic. I'd say you've got about... <laughs> oh, my luck. <laughs> I wish I was dead. <laughs> As he looks into the coagulating cheese. Yeah. <laughs> I'd say you've got about ten minutes. <gasps> I was going to eat my lunch soon. You gasp. <laughs> <laughs> then I suggest you visit the establishment across the street. They do not serve tuna sandwiches, just good food at reasonable prices. <laughs> you believe her, and so you march right out of Honest Maddie's psychic hut and straight into Honest Maddie's old timey kitchen. <laughs> do I not oh, get to on. embrace the psychic? For 30 <laughs> No. <laughs> Not even Wait. for 30 seconds. <laughs> reroll plus one, lock action four. Okay, so you get one of these, which you can use to reroll your dice. Thank you. And we're going to lock action four. Okay. Done. So, cool. there we go. Okay. Hello. Grub. Yes. You're awake in the ship. You get to choose two of the following. <gasps> you can either repair the hull, which is going to add plus one to the hull. You can <laughs> scare off pesky seagulls to gain one supply and give yourself Three infamy. Oh, infamy my is God. the skull tracker. Holy shit! By the way, uh, you I scared could... off some seagulls. Yeah, I know. <laughs> These Dread must be pirate terrifying grub. seagulls. I'm not going to forget your name. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> he doesn't have chips. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> well, you can chart a course, which is going to scout two spaces, which gives us uh, and gives you navigation plus one. So that might Ooh, be very yeah, useful. Probably that. And you can rummage through others' belongings. You can choose a player who didn't choose to work the ship this round and steal a treasure of your choice from that player. Don't, Ooh. don't come for me, please. No, I can't. <laughs> don't worry. <laughs> um, okay, well, I definitely want to scout. Okay. Um, so that gives me one on navigation. It gives you one on navigation. Which and you get to draw. You draw the top two tiles of this deck. Oh, boy. Oh, and you place them. Uh, you can place them basically next to any uncovered one. Yeah. But so probably you start with a ship. We're trying to head this, this way, way, so okay. and we're trying to stay away oh. from this ship. Look at that. We've got some some smooth sailing ahead of us, boys. Oh dear. Oh that's bad. Maybe I'll put this You put this behind us, yeah. Behind us. Should I put it fully behind us? Yeah. Yeah we, so we don't have to go into it. Cool. Um where's our hole at now? Is the, it good to do that? The it's hole is that. on five. You know what? Let's let's do the hole because I think it's good to have that up higher. I'm gonna up be a good the pirate. Yeah. Aww, up the team player. Hole. Yeah. Blair's Whereas being I'm a good just pirate. a player. Yeah. 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 Blair's, Blair's a good pirate, but also does have a also, car that allows her to steal at any point. So you know, it's, it was much of a muchness, really. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, cool. That's me. Okay, and finally, uh, captain's mission. We fill in the next captain's mission box on the ship's log. <laughs> and then we read the entry. Okay. What number is it? Uh, this one? Zero yes. four eight. Zero four eight. Mark that off, please. Gathered around a fire, you and some of the crew listen to the captain read from one of his books. Oh, God. <laughs> All again. witches have a tell, he says. Oh, Despite their ability to shapeshift, each form they might take will still carry the blackened spot upon the back of their neck. Beware the mark, for it means a witch in hiding. A witch in her true form is an alluring and hideous sight. Pale violet skin, eyes that glow like starlight, and the captain's voice trails off as Big Henry begins to shuffle, no. tears rolling down his cheek. Not Henry. What is it, Big Henry? Vance sighs. <laughs> I think I'm a witch, Captain. The large oh, man balls, pointing no. at a mole on his neck. Oh, Big Henry. Big Henry, you're not a witch, groans <laughs> Captain Vance. Now all you listen to me, I ain't reading this for fun. You'll understand soon enough, but this stuff could save your lives one day. <laughs> Everyone grows silent and listens as the old man picks up where he left off. Gain one skill of your choice. Ooh. Oh. There you go. Well, well, well. Did you hear it when she said old man? A good exploration or navigation. <laughs> <laughs> just, a, just a repeat. <laughs> <laughs> So that's the end of the round. Everyone, please take back your standees. Mm -hmm. uh, which one are you? You're this thank one. You. Yeah, uh, and then you. at the round's end, we are going to read entry number 808. Threat plus one. Uh-oh. So we're going to add mm. one threat. No. Dun, dun. Ah. If the threat ever reaches two, we fill another thing on there, and then we read the thing that happens. 
Um, starting with the player with the highest infamy and proceeding clockwise, each player with one or more constellation event tokens must resolve their constellation events. Then the highest infamy player must choose one of the following. Nobody has any constellation event tokens. So the highest infamy player, Ellen, gets Hi. to choose. We can stay on the island, do some more stuff and lose some crew, or we can leave. What what do people feel? I'm gonna I'm gonna I mean we know that there's a safe one to go to. Yeah. So I don't I, mean, I think we're yeah. good to we could afford to lose crew and and, and get do more a bit stuff. more and do a bit more stuff because there's a there's a bunch of stuff here that would allow us to kind of find more bits out. Well, also working the ship's always good because we can get the hull up and we can yeah. get some mm -hmm. um, we can increase our supply and what are our, what are our supplies? Our supplies, supplies are, at 10. are fine. Oh, okay. yeah. And we are at max crew currently so we could lose one and yep. we go down to where we were. Yeah. Before mm -hmm. That's fine. Ella went to the tipsy tortoise. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Although we might not be doing. Any... Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Let's yeah. get out of there. Let's head. Let's yeah. head out. We're we're leaving. Head out. See you we'll later. The, <laughs> the yeah. Dump. Yeah, you, know. you can have too much of a good. You were like, I'll it's call. True. You were like, I'll call you. Yeah, yeah. All right. Uh, the highest infamy player moves the ship one space. <gasps> Let's Take us go. to the storm. Oh. So we are going <laughs> zero, zero, two. The flag on the merchant ship bears the royal crest with a large bumblebee emblazoned on it. The bumblebee delivery service. Every pickings me hearties, laughs the captain. Place your bets now on what they're hauling. Is it dry goods, chesto coins, or maybe beautiful barrels of rum? Remove navigation token 002 from the game. Flip a loaded cannon to its unloaded side. If you cannot, hull minus one. Set dial A to five. Turn to page 53. Whoa, okay, okay, okay. Let's go again. Bang. Um, <laughs> we said <laughs> Remove navigation token 002 from the game. Um, oh no. Bomb. Yeah. Oh no. Flip a loaded cannon to its unloaded side. Oh. Yeah, we can do that. We can do, we that. can do that so we don't lose a thing. That's great. Oh. Set dial A mm -hmm. to five. I can't do it, Captain. Oh, <laughs> Set dial A Believe to in five. yourself. <laughs> That's what the next one. Believe in yourself, it just says. I'll try it. <laughs> <laughs> Put a funny hat on. Um, <laughs> <laughs> turn to page 53. 53. Oh, Jesus. Oh. The boarded ship. Oh, God. At the bottom, it's got a little exclamation mark, and it says, a cornered crew is a dangerous crew. We've got to take out their crew before they do the same to us. A bit too many crews in there. Yeah, that's like a lot of crews. Yeah. Yeah. But I like it. They accrued too many <laughs> crews. Huh? <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we are ready to... We're going to have to make decisions here. Again, oh. we're going to have to fight these people. Our options are we can parlay. Uh, we can fight the enemy crew, we can loot treasure, we can recruit crew, or we can loot cannons. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's uh, let's start the timer and let's uh, choose what we're going to do. Okay. Starting with Alan. Okay, I'm, I'm going to go for nice cannons. Okay, okay. I'm going to loot some treasure. Okay. Is it me? No, it's Lauren. I want to fight, fight someone. Let's fight the crew. Yeah. Dump. Uh, green is anyone, right? What? Oh, yeah. no, sorry, it's player first, then yeah. dump. And then green, yeah, yeah, yeah multiple yeah, people. Fight. Fighting. Okay. Okay, no, good. One good. <laughs> no one chose parlay. No one chose parlay. We ain't here to make friends no. with bumblebee keepers. <laughs> I just want to recruit them. I want to punch a bumblebee. <laughs> I want to punch a bumblebee. All right, here we go. We are going to, first of all, fight the crew. Uh, we do this in infamy Ooh. order, so we're starting with Lorna. Uh, Lorna, you gain uh, brawn plus one. Yeah, nice. and I got a little star. Right? Yeah, and then yeah. you fill in the constellation. This guy. Cool. Nice. Uh, and then perform a brawn check. So you're just going to roll your die, your yellow die, which is in the tray, and add your brawn uh, modifier. Three again. Good plus old one. three. Plus one. Four. <laughs> oh, okay. So for That's that, we get crew move. minus one. Oh. Uh, oh. Or you could use your reroll. No. We've lost little Steve. Uh, we've lost yeah. the heart. <laughs> Big Henry's best friend. Oh, no. <laughs> Henry uh, and Steve, they were such a team. Oh. Dom, you're also going to gain plus one brawn. Yes, lovely. Strong. 
and you roll the same thing. Four. Four. Yeah, <laughs> We're going to lose one crew. Yeah, oh, get no. rid of Big oh, Henry. Uh -oh. Why Little did we Stephen let? Big Henry. <laughs> we sent in someone. So we sent, we sent in somebody who's already dead yeah. to fight <laughs> and wants to debate. <laughs> yeah, and somebody who's just looking over the side to check if there's a sexy horse down there. <laughs> Put down your gun and debate me. <laughs> okay. Well, I am going to <laughs> loot some treasure, which means I'm going to gain one in hunting. <laughs> what? Uh, which means I also get to fill in a thing, and I get one of these. I filled in the constellation. Yeah. And you have to go two to get that. Exciting. Pretty good. Um, and then I get to roll. Uh, oh no. If action, was, if action two was chosen by one or more players this round, perform a hunting check. Oh, good. So because you chose, because you both chose to fight, I get to loot. That's great. Oh, awesome. Perfect. So, hunting check. Mm. I've also rolled a four. Oh That's incredible. <laughs> uh, but I have gained treasure from that. So that's pretty oh, yeah. good. Uh, oh my god, this is perfect. I have a golden dog bone. Sparky, <laughs> our luck is turning. Oh, if you bury this card while the stunt dog treasure is in play, treat wow. it as burying two treasures. Oh. oh. It was fate. That's awesome. <laughs> um, <laughs> it was written in the stars. Yeah. When do you get to bury the treasure? Um, you can bury it as a specific action. So on the... We could have buried treasure as an action on the last place we were at. It was so one usually when you ah. land, yeah. Like the last ah. option seven on the last one was buried treasure. I understand. Uh, and you gain, yeah, you gain one constant. You get to fill in bits of constellation for burying it. Amazing, nice. uh, Blair. You Recruit. are recruiting the crew. Swagger <laughs> plus one. Oh yeah, nice. Uh, and then if action two was chosen by one or more players this round, you get to perform a swagger check. Oh, okay. Here we go. That is a six. A six. Plus two crew. Oh. Bam. Bam. Right. Yeah, so. <laughs> no problems. <laughs> no problems. <laughs> we, were, we watched little Steven get cut down and then we just immediately turned you. to the guy who did it and was like, on. we've actually got space for the <laughs> 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 so. yeah. All nice. right, that worked out okay. really well. Uh, and then finally, Ellen, you're going to loot mm -hmm. some cannons. You get aim plus one. Yeah, and then so it's in a little dot on the thing. Great. And then if action two was chosen by one or more players this round, choose two of the following. You can mm -hmm. steal gunpowder, which gives us plus one supplies. We already have max supplies. Mm -hmm. Steal cannon parts, which allows us to upgrade a cannon by one oh. level. Mm. Steal a small cannon, gain one loaded level one cannon, or steal oh. a big cannon, and we get to read an entry in the book. I think maybe mm. <laughs> the the small load small loaded the small loaded cannon I think it was was the third the third option third option yeah yeah, yeah. Uh, I think that one so yeah, yeah give ourselves more cannons and one that's ready loaded mm -hmm. oh. okay. so you're gonna gain one loaded cannon loaded nice. and then you've got one other thing that you can do. Should we, should we steal the big cannon? Yeah. <laughs> steal the big cannon? Let's get our hands cannon. on that big uh, cannon. Can I have the iPad, please? Yeah. We're going to steal the big cannon. Yeah. yeah. All right. <laughs> so we read entry 509. 509. 509 for the cannon crime. OK. <laughs> big time. Keep going. <laughs> you whistle appreciatively at the firepower the other ship is packing. Thank the gods they didn't shoot any better, stupid beekeepers. Uh, perform a brawn trek. Oh. It's a four. Okay. <laughs> well, we just we click a button Again. here that says one to ten, and we find out what happens. Can't be good. You fail to steal the cannon. Oh. Oh. We didn't get the big one. Oh. Sad. We are down. Okay, so what we're going to do now is this is the end of the round, so we're going to uh, put in this entry number, 825. Uh, who's got the highest brawn? I have plus one. I have plus one. I have plus one. Ooh, who has the highest infamy? I think Ellen has the highest infamy. So we will read to Ellen. Blair, you oh. can read this. Oh boy. <coughs> <laughs> oh sweet mother, cries a horrified crew member of the other ship. They've ki killed little Gertie. You look down at the burly woman you just ran through with your sword. I love you all, she gasps. Oh. Be, be true. To each other. <laughs> she gives one last wheezy gasp 
before her eyes gloss over. Monster! Cries another crew mo- uh, member. Not another crew mother. <laughs> <laughs> How many of them are there? Do you know what? Do you are all a bunch of crew mothers. <laughs> it's take your mother to sea day. <laughs> Uh, monster! <laughs> cries another crew member, and holding a fist in the air, he begins to chant, Lil Gertie! Lil Gertie! Others of his crew join in, and you begin to feel awkward, standing there. <laughs> 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 As pirates! Uh, oh, <laughs> standing there with your sword stuck in the woman and all. You pull it free, but the ensuing mess you make only incites the crowd further. Mock my words, you beast! Spits a woman with patches over both eyes. <laughs> we will not soon forget this vile deed. She was the best to us. She helped me change me life around. Helped all, helped all of us. Oh, there shall be a response. Blood for blood. Revenge for little Gertie. Revenge! <laughs> and all of her crew, including one or two confused members of your own crew, take up the chant. Oh, shit. Little uh, Gertie, little <laughs> Gertie. Little I love little little Gertie. Gertie. <laughs> uh, infamy plus three. Wow. Um, well. I mean, uh, and you get a reroll. Get a reroll oh, for slaying Gertie. They should have debated me. <laughs> <laughs> I could have, I could have used you my reroll. Bored her to re-roll. death. <laughs> okay. I need we to continue. utilize these crew mothers. Okay. <laughs> B-Y-O-M. What's the value of dial A? Uh, five. Oh, that's good because we are going to reduce the hull, crew, mm-hmm. and/or supplies by a total of. Five. That's why we want to kill their crew and members. And then the highest infamy player moves the ship one space. Oh, We're on six for the for the hole. I We've got so many supplies. We okay. can go yeah. down probably like two on supplies and be absolutely yep. I think fine. we could lose one crew as well because we're at max crew. Mm-hmm. We have too many crew. That's three. So we do three, that, so and one, two on that. Two, three. Yep. I don't really want to go down any. Should I go one more and Don't supplies? want to go down any at all. I'll mm. go down one more crew and Four, you go down five. one more supplies. Oh. Go and down that one? is five. No, no, no you're fine. fine. I think really? we Yeah, because I think the ship we like Yeah, that's That's more dangerous, yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. We yeah. we gained crew. We we managed to mm-hmm. recruit, so we're fine. Yeah. Okay. Well, Ellen, you get to move the ship. Okay. Which means you're gonna draw from this part. Okay. Place it where you would like, and we're gonna sail into that space. Okay. Oh! Oh, smooth sailing. The last smooth sailing was the Bumblebee yeah, people. That's true. <laughs> they fucked Whoa. us up. Let's see. 0 27. 27. 0 27. Yar. Okay. Ooh, it's a crossroads event <gasps> called Pa's Whiskey. Huh? No, not Britney uh, Spears. Okay. Read the following <laughs> to the player with the highest aim. Who has the highest aim? Um, not not oh, me. I've got one. Ooh. You've got one in aim. That does make you the highest in aim, I believe. Really? Oh my yeah. Wow. Yeah. Highest in for me, highest brawn, highest aim. Yeah. Absolutely. And you get the <laughs> snogging. Yeah, and the snogging. Well, that's yeah. no wonder. <laughs> <laughs> Ellen, don't miss. <laughs> She's only a one on aim. <laughs> <laughs> Calm down. <laughs> a royal frigate bears down on you, but you're looking down at the bottle of bleached liver whiskey you hold in your hands. A final gift from your pa. He left the world as he entered it, drunk off his ass and naked. But at least he was kind enough to leave one bottle for you to drink and remember him by. Like father, like daughter. (laughs) you've got some options. You can either fashion the bottle of harsh, low-class whiskey, barely suitable for human consumption, into a flaming cocktail to be hurled at the enemy ship. Or you can guzzle the whiskey, preferring to die drunk and happy than sober and screaming. I'm gonna... I'm gonna... You can do it. I'm gonna throw it. You're yeah. throw it. Okay, so we're gonna fashion a Molotov. Nice. Yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> every eye on the sh- every eye on the ship stares at you in wonder. <laughs> Screams of burning sailors assault your ears, and you watch the frigate burn into oh the water oh, in its entirety. Oh, yeah. Howling vortex of flame and death. How big was this bottle of whiskey? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, like, really big. Like, <laughs> I love that you like you completely you unprompted. You just yeah. cast a boat and then you're like, ah! this for your pa. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just drinking. I went, da- Daddy. <laughs> Matey gasps Captain Vance in both wonderment and fear. What in the unholy hells was in that bottle? 
a drunk father's love. You answer. <laughs> Remove navigation token 027 from the oh game. And we get eight, you get aim plus one. Hey! <laughs> oh, I get a star. Great. Cool. Uh, discontent minus one. Very good. Wow. And we turn to page seven. We're doing great. Which we're gonna do Thank this. You. Oh, amazing. We're gonna do this. Thank you. There you are. Oh, there okay. you go. Thank you. Go to page seven. Why haven't you smashed any boats yet? <laughs> yeah, come on. Yeah. I'm too busy on, moping over my horse. <laughs> no. Turn to oh. page seven. Calm down, Admiral Cheeks. <laughs> um, and then we check the threat. Uh, our threat is fine. Hey. Uh, if we had two threat tokens here on this board, we would add to the threat thing on the ship's log. The threat thing. And we would read <laughs> the entry, uh, the threat tracker. We are now in clear sea, oh. which it says, staying at mm. sea too long will put a lot of wear and tear on the hull. <gasps> There are my some nice hole. dolphins to see. Not oh. my hole! Uh, <laughs> not my hole. No more wear my and tear to is, my hole. It's so worn and torn. <laughs> <Jesus>. <laughs> All right. So uh, in this in this uh, scenario, um, there are red boxes for the first time in the game. What that means is somebody has to do these mm. when we are deciding what we're going to do now. So somebody is going to have to do number seven, which mm -hmm. is sail, and somebody is going to have to feed this hungry crew. Mm -hmm. uh, the other options are you can chart a course, which is, as we know, uh, discovering places that we're going to be going. Uh, you can explore, uh, which is going to be exploring this bit of the ocean that we're in. You can spearfish, which is going to gain us cannons, seemingly, and supplies. Uh, we can talk to the crew, have a nice chat, or you can visit the captain in the captain's quarters. So, have a little think about what you might want to do. Mm -hmm. We obviously need to do certain things here. Mm -hmm. Lorna, do the honours, please. Du, 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 All right, I'm going to go sail. Okay. Someone needs to do that. Okay, I'm going to... Ooh, oh, I just, this one, I'm going to explore. Okay. Uh, Lorna. I'll do the crew. Cool. Oh, Eden. God, I wasn't expecting to have a choice. Um, shit, uh, uh, this one. Oh, God. <laughs> Chart of course. And, and I, I shall... I shall Talk to, I shall spear fish. You're going to spear fish. Wonderful. Very good. The good ship, we didn't actually name our ship. We could be the good ship oh, countdown. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Cut the Carol all a borderman. <laughs> oh. Very good. Lorna, you are feeding the hungry crew. You get to choose one of the you get to choose one of the following. You can feed the hungry crew. Pasta. Which is oh, spend wait. a number of supplies. <laughs> not the choice. Okay, so if you feed the crew. Uh, we're going to spend supplies equal to the current hunger. We have eight crew members, and that gives us a hunger of four. So we would lose four supplies. Uh, Lorna would gain an infamy, and we would uh, lose discontent, which we don't currently have any discontent. Mm. We could ask them to go hungry, uh, which would gain you swagger and lose you infamy. And we would also gain discontent, so we'd get two discontent, Ooh. which is potentially bad, but yeah. it's losing four supplies otherwise. Or we can let them raid the supplies. Uh, we can have our infamy grow to four, uh, but if supplies are at zero, the discontent, um, discontent plus two. Otherwise, we lower all the supplies to zero. So we would lose all of our supplies, but let them raid. But you'd gain lots of infamy. Mm. You would gain low. You would become and, and the we, most infamous pirate on the ship. We'd hate your gut. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. No, I feel, I, okay. If we don't already. <gasps> Yes, well, uh, not me. Watch yourself. You're my best friend. The <laughs> infamous <laughs> pirate tightwad. I was with you when you found that skull face. <laughs> um, okay, as mother of the crew. This is my face. Uh, mother cigarettes. <laughs> mother <laughs> cigarettes. <laughs> mum, mummy cigs. Mummy cigs. I I am going to <laughs> make the executive decision <laughs> to starve everyone. Um, <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I'm just going to ask them to go hungry. Okay. Please don't oh, eat anything. So yeah. we're going to gain two discontent. Yeesh. One, two. If these two, if these two trackers ever meet, we lose the game. Here, have um, some cigarettes instead. Yeah. yeah. You gain, you gain, yeah. Tasty, tasty cigarettes. You gain one in swagger. Yes, I do. Uh, and quartermaster, if you could swagger move jagger. cigarettes down in infamy, which swagger. bumps Blair jagger. up one. Oh. So grubbers just raise themselves. Nice. In the ship standing. <laughs> Grab is also up next, who's going to chart a course. Uh, you gain one in exploration. And then please perform an exploration check. Exploration. Okay. Here we go. That is a nine. A nine. Uh, 
On an iron, you get to scout three spaces. <gasps> Ooh, wow. Oh, wow. Swell. Um, okay, well. So put you have to place them first and then so we flip here? them. Yeah. Oh. So I mean, you place all three, but yeah, just place them all oh. and then flip them over. Oh. That one, I guess, here? Yep. And can I do that one? You can it's do it. You to can, that? yeah. Um, is this one? Yeah, that's one. Okay. So we've got one. Oh, that doesn't look great. No. That's, a, that's a big... <laughs> it's a big ship. Big ship. Yep. Big imposing ship Two. with an exclamation oh, mark on it. And fog. And uh, three. An island. Oh, great. Okay. To well. Fog Ship Island. <laughs> of course. Uh, hmm. That's cool. good. Well, Fine. that makes your decision of where we're sailing tricky. <laughs> yep, sorry. <laughs> Does it have to be on something that has a thing on it? No, we can also go blindly. Okay. Go uh, blindly. When we go blindly, we just draw a token mm -hmm. and we flip it over so we don't know. Mm -hmm. uh, so it's a bit of a risk. Meanwhile, I'm going to explore. I get to choose two <laughs> of the following. Uh, I can fight a walrus. Oh! <laughs> fight a walrus! Which will gain me infamy. Uh, <laughs> I choose pistols. Famous walrus killer. <laughs> uh, I can hunt for treasure. I can set some traps, uh, perform a hunting check on a result of 10 plus, re entry 225. Or I can search the sunken ship. Now, what do I want to do? I think I'm going to. I think I'm going to fight a walrus. Yeah. <laughs> fight that yeah. walrus. The walrus, like the the walrus will be played by, it'll be played by Justin Long in this situation. Tusk. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, so I gain plus one in brawn and I gain three infamy. So oh. I become the most infamous Holy cow. pirate on the oh ship. Oh my gosh. No. Did you hear about him? He killed that walrus. Just, I just like, walrus. Oh I am yeah. fisty cups. <laughs> I think I'm, I think I'm going to fight a walrus. I think I'm going to fight a yeah. walrus. Yeah. Imagine yeah. slapping a walrus, the sound. <laughs> <laughs> it'd be really so good. Yeah. It'd, be like, <laughs> it'd be like sort of hitting a gammon at Sainsbury's. Yeah. Like, that With same another sort gammon. Of, yeah. like... <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, the other thing I'm going to do is search the sunken ship. Having punched a walrus, I feel it's now safe to go in the water, for Did I am win? the king of the waves. Did you win? Uh, apparently so. Wow. It doesn't say that I didn't. <laughs> That's impressive. So we're going to read entry 226. Um, Lorna, if you want to read that. You discover an old ship on the seabed, none other than the Piercing Dawn. Oh. It was the ship of Annabel Mont, lost daughter of the king. Oh. You dive deep and luckily you find her quarters near the great cabin. The girl's skeleton lies on her bed. <laughs> But more pleasant are the two chests that sit nearby. <laughs> you will only be able to return with one. Do you take the chest covered in strange symbols or take the chest with the image of a large jewel carved onto its lid? Uh. <laughs> oh, it seems like such an obvious oh, choice. It seems it really like, does. oh, but I kind of want the eldritch one. I want the eldritch one, yeah. please. I want the one with the strange symbols. The strange symbols. You choose the one with the strange symbols. The chest contains several journals that are in a miraculously good condition, mm. thanks to the airtight seal. Seal is in like stamp, yeah, not yeah, like. Yeah. Not as in. Oh, not as in. Oh, not as in. Oh, not oh, not oh, one of the walrus's friends has come for revenge. Well, well. I'll take you. I'll take you all. I'll win. I'm airtight. I'm an airtight seal. <laughs> Seal. You find one curious passage. Father doesn't approve of my trips to Sunset, saying I undo the work of our family, which began centuries ago. <gasps> but I say he's a fool, for he fails to understand the knowledge that can be gained. Bad luck, says a peer, when shown your book. But I tell you what, I'll trade that book for some of my loot. I'm gonna learn to read one day, so that book will really come in handy. <laughs> <laughs> you eagerly agree. Reroll token. one. Nice. Yes. Token. Yeah. That's the one. And then treasure plus one. Treasure Whoa. plus one. Yeah. And then lock. Action three. Okay. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, nobody could fight in the wars. <gasps> Sad. Sad cry. But I got a sack of gunpowder. <laughs> we I can discard to gain aim plus one or supplies plus two. Supply. Oh, that's nice. That's good. Yeah. Uh, a note, you can't have more than four active treasure cards. Yeah. So you would have to bury some, or if oh, you gain nice. a new one, you can swap them out and, and discard away. Well, mine are fantastic then, because they're just giving passive 
Yeah, yours are great. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Meanwhile, I've just got this dog bone I'm waiting to bury, but <laughs> I'll bury it at sea. Even Sullivan the parrot's got his use. <laughs> yeah. uh, Dom, you're going spear fishing. Yeah. Uh, so you get aim plus one. Very good. Uh, aim plus one. Then you perform an aim check. So if I'm right, I'm, so I get plus one because of that, but I also get plus one because of my treasure, right? You certainly do. Oh, oh, so you get plus dog. two to this roll. <laughs> That's a seven. A seven supplies plus one. Oh, it could have been worse. Could have been a lot better. Mm. Could have been worse. Yeah, because you could have speared some treasure there. Yeah. And you could have speared some infamy. <laughs> <laughs> you could have slapped a walrus. Oh. You could have, could have slapped a walrus. If only. If that only. sounds like such a So we gained supplies? <laughs> yeah. Very nice. <laughs> Slapping the walrus. And finally, we are going to sail. You gain one navigation. Great. Uh, you then get to perform. <gasps> I also get, I get to take a little exclamation mark <gasps> token. Oh, oh, constellation token. Yes. All right. And then you get to make a navigation roll. Okay. Eight plus one, nine. Nine. Infamy plus one. <gasps> oh, you're back. Back to it. <laughs> Back to it. <laughs> <Aww>. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> God damn it. I punched that walrus for nothing. <laughs> <laughs> the senseless violence. Yeah. You spend too much time in your room slapping your walrus. <laughs> <laughs> and reading my book. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> um, oh, so yeah. You may spend supplies uh, and or hull to move the ship. For every two supplies slash hull spent, move the ship one space. So we'd have to spend two supplies or a hole to move the ship off this space. Otherwise, oh. I think we just go around in circles here. Oof. Oh, I, I don't want to risk. We've got a way of getting so supplies could, back now. Yeah, so we could, I mean, the thing is we could stay for one more turn and do some more of these things like mm -hmm. visit the captain's quarters and feed the crew, whatever. But again, if we're feeding the crew, we're going to lose supplies. Um, we can't yeah. keep asking them mm -hmm. to go hungry. So maybe just moving on is good. Mm. My hole is big. <laughs> robust, it's very, robust, very strong, robust hull. Firm, strong and stable hull. <laughs> so, if you want to, if you want to have a little bit of my hull, you can have a little. You can have a little but you gotta ask nicely. <laughs> give me thirty minutes <laughs> in the bar. Give me, just give me, a, give me one of those thirty minutes, please. Please, please. Um, <laughs> Supply, I think supplies would be easier to build back because I think hull we can only fix on an island and oh. I don't know when the next island yeah. we'll get to is. Um, so I don't know whether to kind of like, a, that big imposing ship looks terrifying. Yeah. Yeah. So maybe, We only have one loaded cannon. Yeah. We didn't steal the big one, remember? Yeah. So but it is in the right direction. Should we, mm, like, do we want to go straight through? We're going to have to go straight through or do we want to go round? That's going to take ages, isn't it? Yes, so but we're going round, we might reach an island and we can repair the hull. Yeah. And then we yeah. can stop off and then we can go around, but we are risking running near this. What we could do is spend two supplies to move one and then spend one hull to get to the island because we can probably yeah. fix it there anyways. Yeah. That's Maybe? Like you, right? I don't know, is that how it works? I think you have to spend two supplies or two hull. Oh. So yeah. you could do two supplies and two hull. If we're going to the island, then... Yeah. We'll, then Give it a couple of the hull. Yeah, because if we if we yeah. if we rolled fifteen plus, it would only cost one hull to move, basically. Mm -hmm. So it's, chances it's are at the island we, are, we might be able to stay there for a couple of rounds and get the hull back up to. Yeah. 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 All right, let's do it. Let's go to the island. It's worth a risk. Ooh. So what, where we're we going to fully spend? We're going to spend two to go four to go to the island. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, that's cool because I can discard this immediately okay. to give us plus two supplies back. Yeah. Yeah. So we could actually just do it all from supplies. We can spend oh. four supplies, gain two back, and then we've only spent two supplies. My hole remains untouched. <laughs> <laughs> Unsullied. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not giving you another 30 minutes yet. Yes. No right. wars. So we're going to go one, no two, and we are now here. Uh, at the round end, we read entry 802. Uh, threat plus one. Oh. <gasps> the threat thing. <laughs> yeah. uh, starting with the player with the highest infamy and proceeding clockwise, each player with one or more constellation token event event tokens must resolve their constellation oh. events. So we actually get to do this. Mm. Exciting. So this is a really good game. Mm. It's really so cool we get fun. to we get to so we discard the token and then we fill in the next we fill in the bit and then we're going to read the corresponding text. Okay, I cat biscuit biscuit a man for over an hour before sending him to his god. <laughs> 
Oh, uh, God. Oh my <laughs> it had been there all those years ago. Maybe it didn't matter that he didn't pull the trigger or give the order. Maybe what matters is that he didn't do anything to stop it. Maybe I don't even need reasons now. Infamy plus three. I'm fine Whoa. with it. Oh my God. You're fine with it. You're so I'm just, I'm just real mad. Wow, this so is so horrible. Real flirty. <laughs> I squirmed as it slid down my mouth. Mm. It wasn't the worst thing I've eaten. But the thought of eating a live miniature albatross made my stomach do cartwheels. Pirates sure do have quite an expansive array of things they qualify as food. Plus three supplies. Oh, oh sick. Oh, my goodness. Wait, that's really so cool. lucky. Did the ship move for this round? Yes, it did. Read the entry list on the ship's new space. Nine, Nine seven, seven, one. one. Oh my god. It just says you've sunk. This is great. Okay, here we go. We're going to take these off. Thank you. And I will tell you some more about it in a second. Thank you. Da -da -da -da. Thank you. Put this over here. Gosh, okay, we get thrust pl threat plus one. No. Very oh. cool. Uh, return all revealed navigation tokens face down to the pile. Uh, <laughs> we're going to turn to page 37. Oh no. Is it like a. Oh. The forest. Uh, we check the threat. We we do have threat. Yeah, we That's have not a lot good. So we're gonna t we're gonna check the box on that. Uh, oh no! This one. Yep. Read entry seven. Read nine entry nine seven nine one. The threat thing demands it. Seven <laughs> nine one. The dreaded threat thing. <laughs> this is for you. This is absolutely for you. <laughs> <laughs> a sickly looking parrot crashes onto the oh, deck. No. Son of a Wait, it might be a bastard. <laughs> <laughs> The crew gathers around it, thinking it is surely a bastard. Uh, sorry, <laughs> that it is surely dead. <laughs> Poor little blighter! Blubbers sad Sally. Sad Sally. <laughs> Stop your weeping, Captain Vance chuckles as he pushes everyone aside. This here is me old parrot Flapjacks, and believe me, he will outlive us all. What is it, me boy? Flapjacks jumps to life, rustling the sad patch of feathers on his back. Razor on the move, the parrot squawks. Razor oh, coming no. for you, coming for you all! The crew gasps, fearing what Captain Razor would do if he found them. Best get moving then, Captain Vance shouts. Discontent, plus one. Mm. Oh, good. <laughs> Move special location token 9621 space towards the ship. Ah. No. Are the ship and special location token 962 on the same space? No. no. <laughs> Remove all threat from the threat thing. Oh. Oh. Dun, 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 dun. Threat thing oh clear. My God. Done. Okay. There we are. Wonderful. So we have reached the forest. It looks lovely. It's nice. Yeah. Oh, so we need to <laughs> fuck off that yeah. way. Can we just hide? <laughs> yeah. Or we run this way. Like, can we just hide in the we've, forest? We've redone. We've got. We can. Re we don't have yeah, exactly. big, scary shit. Yeah, exactly. We've reshuffled. Yeah, it's quite good. So, yeah, it's we fine. can. We can get the hull up to. Top, top, top. We've got supplies. Top, top. Awesome. There's so much we can do here. Thank we can you. stay here forever. We can bury the treasure. I'm gonna bury my treasure. Yeah. <laughs> we can start a new life in the forest. Oh, this is what I'm thinking. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we don't need to be pirates. We can just just hang out here with mm. all the parrots. Apparently, mm. we can eat all the parrots. Oh well. Yeah, well, I it's time to decide. <laughs> uh, oh, we, so we can go to the forest shack, search the forest. We can gather food. We can rest. Uh, we can work the ship. Resting gives you minus discontent, that's good. Uh, we can work the ship, obviously, and patch it up. Uh, we can do a captain's mission, or we can bury some treasure. Mm -hmm. Which one's rest? Oh, that one. Shall Are you ready? Three, two, one. Uh, I'm going to work. Um, I'm burying treasure. Okay, I'm going to go gather food. Nice. Lorna? Lorna? Lorna. <laughs> and I'll work the ship as well. Wonderful. All decided. Stop the timer. Stop the timer. <laughs> okay. I'm not good at my, I'm not good it's okay. It's okay. Cigarette. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just thinking about the horse. It's hard to stop a sand timer in the middle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Cigarettes, you've gone to the forest shack. Mm -hmm. You get to choose one. You can knock on the door. <gasps> you can search the crates behind the shack. <sighs> You can raid the shack, which gains you brawn, uh, and you can f then perform a brawn check. Uh, or, well, and you get you get entries for doing the brawn check. So you, basically, every single time it's going to be a bit story. Um, I'm going to raid the shack. Raid the shack. Okay, yeah. so you gain brawn. How many brawn? One brawn. One brawn. You get a dot on your thing. Yeah. 
Look. Well. <laughs> Got the dust on your face. Not on the back of the neck. Just hear Big Henry. Oh, no. Oh, no. Alrighty then. This is for you. You're going to do a brawn check. Oh, dear. Oh, no. Plus what? Plus one. One plus one. one plus one. Plus two. Plus two. Three. Is three. Okay, great. That's still not over not. the 14. You need to roll to probably get the good ending. Yeah, and I think, yeah, that's going to be divided into But we're going to find bad. out with uh, this. You lead several crew to the shack where you bravely <laughs> kick open the door. Aside from some rotting furniture, the only inhabitants live in the large rainbow jacket hive in the floor. <laughs> Oh no. Oh no, you've kicked a wasp's nest. The oh. angry buzzing rainbow jackets chase you and the crew all the way back to the water. When they finally disperse, despite your eyes being swollen from the stings, oh, no. you can still see how beautiful they look swarming away in the sky. Fill in one star on your constellation. Lock action one. Okay. That's action not one too bad. Is what is locked. What? Put it. <laughs> I'm confused because we're all the worst. Why are there worse yeah. in every game we play? Yeah. <laughs> what of a hornet? What but what of a hornet? hornet? Grub. Grub. You're gathering food. You get hunting uh, plus one. Ooh. And then you're going to perform a hunting check. Hunting plus one. Okay. Hunting. Here we go. Big hunting. That's a seven. Seven. Uh, total plus plus your hunting. So that's a, yep. Okay. Supplies plus three. Oh. And you gain a reroll. Hey. Okay. Nice. 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 It's pretty good. Okay. Our supplies are so good now, you guys. Yep. We don't need to worry about them. Uh, we okay. now work They're the so ship good. in infamy order. So we start okay. with Ellen. Uh, so you can choose two of the following. Repair the hull. Hull plus one. Scare off the pesky sea squiddles, mm -hmm. uh, which is we're going to gain supplies and you gain three infamy. You can chart a course, which is navigating two spaces, and you gain navigation plus one. Or you can rummage through other people's belongings. You choose a player who didn't choose to work ship this round, and you steal a treasure of a choice from that player. Mm. Um, I think I'm going to uh, fix a hull. Like, yep. get a hull up nice and strong. Yes. <laughs> Nice. Cool. Even, even stronger. Even stronger. She's already yeah, in a good yeah. place. An impenetrable yeah. hull. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to spend 30 minutes on that. <laughs> Against cigarettes' <laughs> will, an impenetrable hull. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Just All right. One or two. One. one. Yeah, I think I think maybe charter course. Let's try and get away from that mm -hmm. big okay. boat. So you gain nice. navigation mm -hmm. for doing that. Okay. And you get to place these two. So. Uh, okay. And then flip them over afterwards. Just Ba -ba. Right. Oh, oh. oh fuck's sake. Oh, it's only a, is that a big ship? Oh, oh no! I think we might have to fight our way out oh, here. Because we don't want to get caught by this guy. Dom, you're working the ship. Yes. What would you like to do? You can repair the hull, fight the sea squirrels, chart a course so you can rummage through other people's belongings. I will start by scaring off those pesky sea squirrels. Okay, so you gain, we gain one supplies, which we max supplies, yep. but Dom gains three infamy. Ooh. Yeah, finally, people know my name and face. The boy who fought the squirrels. <laughs> yeah. I, I'd rather you remember me for the skeleton face. No. Um, <laughs> the squirrel fighter. Oh, so impressive. Almost as impressive as that man who punched us walrus once. Um, I slapped the walrus. <laughs> You're more impressive than, than him now. Yeah, that's yeah. it. Yeah, well, sea squirrels. It's old history, isn't it? <laughs> sea squirrels are a real thing. What is a sea squirrel? Mm, they're not a real thing. Well, yeah, but it's um, <laughs> like a scaly squirt. Is it in yeah. live in the water? Yeah, I think it's like. <laughs> I'm thinking my head around it. That's where my imagination stops. <laughs> it's the, it's the actual end of it. it. <laughs> the, the juxtaposition yeah. of two things is where your imagination just stops. No, that's <laughs> not. That's not right. It's not right. <laughs> we tried what? explaining seahorses, and it just. Oh, wow. <laughs> what? Yeah. Um, what was the other thing you'd like to do? I think, well, let's chart a course and let's yeah. see what these are. Yeah. Oh, very I think good. That's a good yeah. idea. Is it these ones? Yes, it is. There we go. And uh, now flip them. Flip them. Flip them. Flip. Oh, that looks fine. Maybe. Uh, that might be like no. a pirate oh, public. Jesus. I'd rather sail into a storm than into a fight. Yeah. And, I get, um, I get and you get plus one navigation. Which actually Wee. means I'm going to get a, um, I've completed one of my... Oh, and you get a little guy. Yay. There you go. Lovely. I like this game. It's really fun. Yeah, yeah. satisfying. Very satisfying. And finally, I'm going to bury some treasure. I can discard up to two treasures. For each treasure I discard, I fill in one star on my constellation. I only Ooh. have one treasure that I can bury, but it's the mm. golden dog bone. 
And if I bury this card while I have Sparky the stunt dog with me, uh, I can treat it as burying two treasures anyway. So I get to oh, fill in great. two on my constellation. That's, that's so good. So I'll do really that. Good. Yay. Oh, uh, when I gain one or more infamy, I gain an additional infamy because of my loudmouth parrot. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Oh. That's right. Sorry, I don't know why I'm oh taking yours off. Oh. Yeah. Is, is, he the, is he the one who got rid of the sea squirrel? Yeah, she got rid of the sea squirrel. Get <laughs> <laughs> on the squirrel. Shut up, Sullivan. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the end of the round, Still we're going to read 817. Bop, bop, bop. Threat plus one. That's Ooh. fun. We might want to move quickly now. Mm -hmm. um, starting with a player with the highest infamy and proceeding clockwise, each player with one or more constellation event tokens must resolve their constellation events. Mm -hmm. Then the highest infamy player must choose one of the following, which is we can stay and lose crew or we can leave. It was weird bumping into Terry de Toulouse <laughs> after, <laughs> after all these years. And it was painful to be dressed all scroungy the way I was. And her looking all fancy now. <laughs> <laughs> I guess the education my folks gave her paid off. She shouldn't have been traveling with so many baubles. But hey ho, that's a lesson they don't teach you in school. Uh, which means I get treasure plus one because I stole it from Terry. Um, oh yeah. What is oh, yeah. it? Oh, exactly. Got my treasures. Yeah, got your treasures and I get a reroll as well. Nice. Very good. Very nice. And the treasure is Crater Grubs. Classic Terry. Um, <laughs> Crater Grubs. <laughs> 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 uh, you always no. see Terry walking around. No, Tiny little ones of you. <laughs> <isn't it>? <laughs> <laughs> Hello. <laughs> we Which, never said we had a maggot to cook. <laughs> yeah. Oh, imagine, it's just a giant maggot cooking all the food. Oh. 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 <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, box of, box of What's maggots. for dinner again, Grub? Sugar. Sugar. <laughs> Sugar. <laughs> <laughs> Sugar. <laughs> Sugar. 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 Really good cook. Um, <laughs> one day I'm going to fly out of here. Albatross on a roar. I don't like fishing. Um, <laughs> There we go, we've got a box of maggots. <laughs> box of Terry's maggots. Um, discard to gain supplies plus two. Terry's chocolate yeah. maggots. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's not Terry's, it's, it's mine. mine. <laughs> it's maggots. Discard to gain two supplies <laughs> or discard before performing a hunting check to add four to my result. Oh, crazy. Um, but I have to That's do it before right. performing the check, so I must remember that. Very good. That's lovely. Dom, you also get to choose. Are we going to stay and lose some crew or are we going to leave? Um, one thing I will say, if we do stay, we're going to do that entry again, which means we are going to gain threat. Mm. I feel like we should move because we've got great Our supplies hull. are good now. We've got supplies, mm -hmm. we've yeah. got crew. We're in a really good position. I think let's move. Okay. Let's get out of here. We're going to leave. Uh, the highest player, the highest infamy player moves the ship one space. <gasps> Where to though? So Tricky. Our, yeah, again, the issue is if we gain threat on this space and this thing moves, the game's over. Mm. When does oh. it move? It might, it, we don't know. This is the thing is if this entry here ends up like the end of this entry is like, oh, gain some threat and then do a threat check, mm. it's likely this ship's going to move onto our space and mm -hmm. end the game oh. for us. Okay. Oh God. So away from that then. So, yeah. oh, so maybe sailing back up the way we came is Into all this the, trouble. Yeah, it's unfortunately yeah. the best way to go. Or we could go blind north. Yeah. Like just yeah. straight up. I think sailing. Trouble. You reckon the trouble? Yeah. Trouble. You're in trouble, do you? All right. Trouble, please. Oh, 18. Trouble, please, Carol. <laughs> Carol on Borderman. Yeah. <laughs> uh, fog test. You fog enter test. a troubling fog that rises ah. up without warning. Ah. An ill omen this be, says the captain. He turns to you and asks, So, matey, let us test your skills. What should we do when facing a foul gloom? such as this. Uh, and you can advise the captain to stay the course and push through the fog, or you can advise the captain to slow the ship until the fog passes. Mm. What would we like to do? Well, it makes sense to s slow down, right? Yeah, well, especially if we're near rocks, because we might... Mm. Yeah, yeah, I, th I reckon slow down. Makes I sense. Makes yep. sense. Slowing down? Yeah. Mm. Advise the captain to slow the ship until the fog That's passes. test. Okay. <laughs> my ship theory test. Perfect choice, me matey, says the captain with an approving nod. Always best to play it safe. No point crashing into who knows what. 
When the fog evaporates, you spy an enemy ship off the port bow. Oh. It too seemed to be moving cautiously in the fog. If you had been sailing at top speed, you would have crashed into it. Ooh. Remove wow. navigation token 15 from the game. Bye. Uh, and re we're getting oh, one reroll, which I assume Ooh, goes to Dom as the highest infamy player. And we turn to page 55, where it says, Ooh. page 55. Ooh. Frigate. Oh the frigate. Destroy the enemy's hull if you want to sink them. Take out their sails if you want to board them. <gasps> mm. oh. uh, set dial A to four. And dial B to seven. <gasps> oh, I wonder which one's which. Is that their cannons, do you reckon? Oh, God. Oh, oh no, oh bother. Oh, okay, so it looks like we are in a fight with this frigate. Uh, we can rally the crew. Uh, one person can do that, um, which means we're going to minus A and B. Going to gain reroll and uh, swagger. Uh, we're going to gain reroll if we load cannons, and we are going to gain infamy. If we fire the cannons, we are going to aim at them, lose. They're going to lose A and B, and we're going to gain infamy. Gather yeah, debris is. Just gaining supplies, basically, and looting. Mm -hmm. Or we can try to escape. Um, so, mm -hmm. what do we want to do? Get ready to decide. Um, Bosun, start us off. This role is so... This is like the role you give to a child. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Beep. Don first. Uh, I'm gonna, uh, we, we've got a cannon we can fire. Yep. Uh, choose one of the following targets. Yeah, let's. I'll fire the cannons. Mm -hmm. Okay. We, we could do Cannon. loading, loading the cannons. I'm going to try. Well. Oh, You're awesome. going to escape. I'm going to rally the crew. Uh, shit, I wasn't ready so, so for something cannons. else. Uh, okay. Um, mm. I guess I will. Oh, no, sorry, I'm not next. Here's you, here's here's me. Next, yeah. oh. Load the cannons. And Lorna. Load the cannons. Oh, great. Right. We're going to. We're all loading the cannons <laughs> while <laughs> Ellen's trying to walk out the back door. <laughs> <laughs> See you guys. It's <laughs> just. Winching yourself down in a lifeboat. I, I lucked <laughs> out with the fireboat thing. Yeah. <laughs> this one's bigger. <laughs> all right. We are going to, first of all, rally the crew, which Come is on, we gain boys. one Woo! in swagger. Lovely. Let's go. Uh, and then we perform a swagger check. Swagger check. Swagger check. A two. <laughs> two. Choose one rally option below. We can gain a reroll. Uh, we can choose another player, they gain a skill of your choice. Choose another player, they gain reroll plus two. Or reduce either dial by one. I'm going to reduce dial A by one, I think. Uh, next up, it is Grub, who is loading cannons. Choose two of the following. You may spend one supplies to flip one cannon from its unloaded side to its loaded side. You may choose this multiple times. You can gain infamy, or you can gain a reroll. And you um, actually get two of these. Okay. Well, definitely load one of the cannons because we have plenty of supplies. Um, we can't load another cannon because they're both loaded. <laughs> so... <laughs> um, oh, did you, spend the, did you spend the supply to do that? Yeah. yeah. Uh, I guess I'll take... I don't really care about infamy. It's not really... You want a reroll? Like I'll take a reroll. All right. Yeah. Uh, and then <laughs> Cigarettes has rushed over to help, found that all the cannons are loaded. <laughs> what would you like to do, oh, Cigarettes? I was going to load some cannons, but you've already got that sin too. Yeah, so. it's alright, I got it. Yeah. You can choose Infamy twice, and you can choose Reroll twice. Can I choose Infamy twice? You can choose Infamy twice. Get one Infamy twice. I'll be known as the girl that tries to fill the full cannons. <laughs> <laughs> the latest in the girl with the dragon tattoo series. Yeah. Two ball cannon. Cigarettes. Okay. Cigarette, two balls. So for firing the cannons, Dom, you get aim plus one. <laughs> yep. Uh, Great. And then you can choose one of the following targets. The enemy hull, dial A, or the enemy sails, di dial B. You then perform an aim check. Well, what are we trying to do? Board them or sink them? Like, we're closer to sinking them. Uh, yeah, sinking them, I guess. Feels like, yeah, feels like a waste. Yeah, it feels like a waste. Because also, well, the thing is, once we board them, we also have to fight the people on board. There's like two steps to this. Yeah, that sounds great. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We just need to go to the island and look for the... Tr we're just looking for yeah. treasure. Yeah. Yeah. Right. I don't... You, you choose, Doc. I'm, I'm tempted. What do we think? What do we think? You, you, you your hull, you your sails. I'm, I'm hull. I run away. <laughs> you run away. Oh. You think sails? Sails. Yeah, let's do sails. You're outnumbered. Uh, voted. That's fine. It's a very democratic uh, 
crew. I've rolled a 12 and I Whoa. get plus, uh, plus uh, that's 14, 15. Holy shit. So we get 15. Which is reduced targeted dial by two and gain an infamy. Mm. It's already the most infamous. Yeah. <gasps> Very nice. Lovely. I love that for me. <laughs> love that flip, for me. Uh, you, and before you flip one cannon to its unloaded side. Okay. Oh, you oh. can add the bonus to the result if you want to. <gasps> oh, well, we should. Uh, yeah, absolutely. That so you were on, you'd rolled 15, hadn't you? So yeah. that would take it up to 18. Which means, so uh, yeah, so we could have reduced it by three, so and that's one would, more. And you would gain three. Well, three three, three, it doesn't yeah. matter. So that now, now, now it's anyone's game. Yeah, and, so now uh, unload that cannon. Oh, we've got this. Yeah, nice. We're going to take this ship, and then we're going to sink it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so escape, both. navigation check. Mm -hmm. uh, so you gain so one navigation. Navigation. And? going to do that. There you go. All right. Okay, five. Five. Plus three is eight. Nothing happens. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. Great, you stand there. You stand there going, Because it's hard to escape, because you'd okay. have to roll above 13 and we can and, escape yeah. and move from And the you ship. have to subtract uh, four from, from your Okay, bag. yeah, so, so that, would only, that would only be four. Oof. So nothing happens. So we have to destroy the ship before we can escape as well. Okay. Okay. So now we're going easier. to read number eight to six, please. Is dial A at zero? No. 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 Is dial B at zero? No. <laughs> they attack. Oh shit. Oh, no. Roll, Roll a die. die. <laughs> Roll, a Roll a die. die. <laughs> Two. Reduce hull. No. By one. Reduce hull. Oh, crew and or supplies oh. by a total of two. So it's oh, that's be two fine. between them. Um, uh, I, I mean, don't think we, we should lose, lose crew. We can, yeah. lose, yeah, we can no, lose two supply easy. Sense. My hull is huge. <laughs> <laughs> So you keep saying, well, what's the ship like? Huge yeah. and unexplored. We, oh, and also the, in the game, uh, we, we, what, uh, can we split it between two? <laughs> and so or, and or. You can and or, or. So, yeah. or yeah. so we could just lose one from both? You're yeah. likely yeah. under the radar. <laughs> Love that. One, one, yeah, one yeah, from both? Good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. Yeah, great. I'm, my hull is going down. Uh, uh, begin a new round on this page. Done. Okay, okay. Start okay. Joke, so we all go back to where we came from. <laughs> That's just for the viewers, not for us. <laughs> so the boys and we know what we're doing. Uh, Boson, start us off. The order's changed quite dramatically yeah, in that last round. So let's start the timer. Dom's placing first. Oh, God. Um, oh, God. What was I going to do? I, I'm oh, going to fire the cannons. Fire the cannons. Fire yeah, the cannons. Fire the cannons. Bang, bang. Bang. Also fire the cannons. Fire the cannons. Uh, Lorna? I should probably load the cannons, right? Yeah, load yeah, the cannons. You've yeah, you've practiced now. You've had your dress rehearsal. I'm going to gather the debris. <laughs> um, I need, I want to get some of that. Okay. Here we go. So we're loading the cannons now. Choose two of the following. Uh, spend one supplies to flip a cannon from its unloaded side to its loaded side. Uh, you can gain infamy or a reroll. Should I? Do we have enough supplies for me to load a cannon? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm going to load a cannon, please. Carol. Two, isn't it? Yeah. It's one supply. Oh, it's just one? Yeah. And more infamy for Lorna. Another infamy. <laughs> Get pushed down the pecking order. Oh, no. <laughs> Shame on everyone's lips. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you won't forget your first cigarettes. <laughs> uh, Dom, you are firing the cannon. Bang, so you bang. get aim plus one. Yeah, fantastic. Oh, I get a star. Before rolling, you may flip one loaded cannon to its unloaded side to add its bonus to your result. Oh. So it's probably worth doing anyway. Mm. Oh, so. We can fire with empty. You can fire with no. You can fire without. Stuff it with forks. Using the cannons. Oh, yeah. Wow. Yeah. Well, we'll do that for sure. It's a good job we did. Uh, that's a six. Plus. Nine plus um, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. On a thirteen, wow. reduce the targeted dial by two, which I'm assuming is the sales because yeah. that's what we're doing. You gain an infamy. You're already at max infamy. Lovely. Max infamy. <laughs> max infamy. Helen. Uh, plus one to aim, first of all. Mm -hmm. oh, well, I can't. Oh, you can't, you're max aim. Oh. Uh, do you want to unload one of the cannons in order to add to this roll, targeting the sails, I assume? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yep, so we're going to unload this cannon? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yep. Good Come on. Eight. Uh, plus, plus two, two ten. ten, plus three, thirteen. Very Again, nice. reduce the targeted dial by <gasps> two and gain an infamy. Are you going for the sails? Heck yeah. 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 So we Take have yeah. destroyed the sails. <laughs> we have destroyed their sails. Very good. Very good. Okay. okay. 
Uh, meanwhile, next. I'm gathering debris. Mm. Uh, so What's I get, he doing down I get there? plus one in the hunting. What's Why is he thinking of cheese in this time? <laughs> Bits of flops debris. Debris. Very good. I oh, like it. That's very good. Uh, so I'm adding two to this. <laughs> 12. Oh. 11 plus. Choose three gather options below. Supplies plus one. Oh, great. Woo. Uh, I gain a reroll token. And I gain a treasure. Oh. Wow, so many things. Mm. I found an expensive rope. Oh. Oh. <laughs> you may discard when you would lose one or more crew to lose one fewer crew. <gasps> That's nice. Mm. Oh, you throw it uh, out to them. You, yeah, you rope them up. Yeah, very good. <laughs> <laughs> they can't <laughs> leave. They can't leave. <laughs> okay. Um, uh, and then finally, Blair is trying to escape. Navigation plus one. Yes. Get us out of here. Can I have an, a little exclamation mark, please? You get one of these. Yes. Yay. Thank you. Uh, and then perform a navigation check, uh, and we subtract the value of dial B from your result. So, which is zero. Well, that's lucky. One plus your navigation. I'm just going to use a little re-roll, I think. Okay. Unless, I mean, do we want to escape? Well, because uh, we're we would board, we would board we? the ship next, I think. Nah, yeah. Basically, doesn't matter. this, this we don't need to escape. move. This is fine. So you've gained your, you've yeah. gained your navigation, yeah, got your star token. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, so 826, 826. Yar. Did the ship move this round? No. Uh, is dial A at zero? No. no. Is dial B at zero? Yes. Yar. Yar. Uh, Discontent minus one. Ooh, very nice. Uh, turn to page 53 and set dial A equal to the number of players. So change that to uh, five, please. And we're going to page 53, which is one page before. It's exciting, isn't it? <laughs> the boarded ship, we've been here before! Oh, oh, yes. ah. yar, yar. I'm going to take my guy back. Play the Pirates of the Caribbean music. We're coming in. It's the Pirates! <laughs> Caribbean, the Bean. Here all right. comes all the Pirates. <laughs> 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 okay, so now we are fighting the people on this boat. Ooh. Captain. Start the timer. Oh, God. Uh, I'm, I'm going to get that big cannon this it's time. Gonna get the We're going to get the big cannon. Uh, Ellen. I'm going to loop some treasure. Lorna. Should I also try and get the big cannon just in case? Dom we can oh, you can't, you can't, because only one person uh, can do it. Uh, I'm going to get me some of that. Fighting the Nemonic crew. Fighting the Nemonic crew. Uh, me, I'm going to also fight I'm the also going to fight. Yeah, we're all fighting the enemy yeah. crew. Wonderful. <laughs> Fuck you, crew. Yeah. Okay, oh, stop the timer. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> One job. <laughs> Come on, cigarettes. <laughs> God damn it, cigarettes. Get together, man. Uh, gain a brawn, Blair. Am I going first? Oh, sorry, no. Lorna first. Gain a brawn. Gain and Brawn. Yep. Gain. What does that mean? Uh, down here. <laughs> Gain and it's a good pirate name. Gain, 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 Gain and Brawn. Gain and Brawn. What does Gain mean? You Gain. add one. Oh, Gain and Brawn. My first language is Esperanto, so I'm going to translate everything. You're talking with an accent. <laughs> Gain and Brawn. Oh, okay, and Brawn. These people don't know the Queen's English. <laughs> oh my gosh. That's technically an accent. Six, <laughs> yeah. seven, eight, nine. Eight nine. Uh, so we reduce dial A by one, and you gain a reroll. Wait a minute. That's a, oh, oh no, it was a six. Yeah, there you go. Thank you. you uh, so reduce this by one, please. Oh yes, lovely. Whoa! Whoa look at that go. Uh, Down myself. Go. I get to gain a brawn. I get to gain a brawn. And I get to constellation. A constellation <laughs> for me. Um, constellation okay. prize. Not that con oh, constellation okay. prize. <laughs> I'm going to a brawn check. Uh, that's a nine. Uh, reduce dial A by one, and I gain a reroll. Got three of those. They're dropping like flies. Sorry, man. Mm. Blur, you gain a roll. <laughs> <laughs> My children! <laughs> okay, uh, get a bronze. Uh, <laughs> 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 right, yes. yeah, no, Grub's right. got arrested development. <laughs> oh, but yeah. the yeah. children have hatched dead quick. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And right. again, and again. Great, 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 uh, great, great grandmother. That's a nine. Nine. Uh, we lose one in column A. I and flies. you gain a reroll. Thank you. All. They breed, they breed like flies. <laughs> <laughs> Especially those little fruit flies. Oh, and they, they, breed like and fruit they are smart. Yeah. 
Because yeah, if you try and hit one of those fruit flies, they'll suddenly be like, they'll all suddenly try and come and forget you. Yeah. <laughs> to get you? They're so many. Meat flies, the big, the big flies, they, they mess off. I don't off. mind. Yeah. The little fruit flies just like, oh, you're trying to kill me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to bother you. And they know you're playing, because then they'll land on something for a bit and you'll go to hit them and be like, ah. <laughs> well, Helen's looting some treasure. Um, <laughs> you gain hunting plus one. Yay! <laughs> uh, and then if action two was chosen by one or more players this round, you can perform a hunting chair. <gasps> nice. Okay, seven. I might re-roll on that actually. Let's see if I can do. Ten. Ten. Ten plus, okay, plus one. Ten plus eleven. one is eleven. Uh, you gain two treasure. Oh, <gasps> very good. Amazing. Okay. What did you get? Puffy blouse. Ah, now that's a puffy shirt. <laughs> so I've got plus two in swagger and plus one in navigation. Incredible. Oh, very good. Puffy it's because you know what the way wind, you know how the wind blows. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Yeah. Is that why they wore puffy sail. blouses? <laughs> no. No. Um, and then I've also <laughs> no, sorry, got. Dude. No. Oh my gosh, we're talking about fruit flies. I've got a sack of moldy fruit. Um, so I can discard. Oh, I can that in the of grubs. Yeah, we've got yeah. great grubs. We can breed. I can discard this <laughs> to gain grubs. swagger or supplies plus two. Okay, and finally, looting the cannons. Uh, it's Dom who gets that gain plus one aim. Big. Gun. And then, if action two was chosen by one or more players this round, choose two of the following. You can steal gunpowder. You can steal cannon parts, which upgrades one of our cannon's levels, which means the, the value they get is, is plus five. Mm -hmm. uh, steal a small cannon, which is we gain one loaded level one cannon. Um, so you could upgrade and then steal another cannon. So we'd have four cannons, uh, three cannons. Uh, or you steal the big one. Mm. Oh yeah, I get two, two actions. I think let's upgrade one cannon. Mm -hmm. So we'll do that. That's a level two now. Level two cannon. Lovely, lovely. Would be unloaded because we had yeah. used all of our ammo. Yeah. Um, do, do, do. Upgrade one cannon by one level, and then and then let's get the big cannon. Yeah. Big cannon. Get the big cannon. Five oh nine. Big cannon. Big cannon. Big cannon. Big cannon. Big. Oh, how how long? I thought one this job. would be a big quicker. <laughs> <laughs> I had to reach all the way over there. <laughs> I was busy. Perform big a brawn cannon. check. Big right. cannon. Big 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 cannon. Uh, my brawn is up. plus one. Okay. <laughs> yes. here? No. So I'm not the best at this, unfortunately. Do I not gain brawn beforehand? Steal, steal the big cannon. You don't know. <gasps> you can always reel around. Big, big cannon. Big cannon. Big cannon. Big cannon. Twelve. Oh! Thirteen. Oh! Boop. Gain one. Loaded level Ooh. four or lower cannon. We really got the big cannon. Very nice. And it's loaded. Oh, yep. ching. Ch -ching. Oh, that's so good. What is it called? What's it called? Ooh. It's called. Um, <laughs> it's called. Acid reflux. Because <laughs> <laughs> it will make you feel sick. Uh, <laughs> That's it. That's all it does. Just makes you a bit animal. <laughs> <annoying. laughs> okay. Now, the big six is a metaphor. It's so big. You'll be like, oh no, I hope that doesn't fire. Oh, my bile is rising. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, this is once again the crossroads event, revenge, in which little Gertie. <gasps> A new little Gertie. A new one. A new one. <laughs> Dies. Mother! Ah! All the crew uh, mothers swarm. Yeah. <laughs> little Gertie, little Gertie. Oh no, in fact, let's read. Oh. This is different. Oh. oh! You give a loud huzzah as you cut down your opponent. She hits the floor hard, rolling to the side and revealing a double set of eye patches. <gasps> oh no! Wait a moment, you say. You seem familiar. You, she hisses. No, it had to be you, didn't it? Oh, little girly, I failed you. I swore revenge only to fall victim to the same families that butchered you. <gasps> Look, it's it's combat, right? You argue, pointing at your sword. A little bit of hack and slash, just trying to do my job. If you got to know me, you'd think I was a pretty decent sort. All devils claim decency, spits the dying woman. 
Perform a swagger check. The highest infamy. Pl- oh, the player with the highest brawn does this. I have two brawn. I have three One. brawn. Three brawn. Wow. Highest brawn. Form a swagger check. <laughs> Which is going to look mad swagger. No, I don't. Just lots of cigarettes. Three, four. Four. <laughs> One, oh, <God>. You what? <laughs> so oh, Bad no. swagger. I don't want to buy some cigarettes. <laughs> 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 Look, I'll show you, you insist. First, I'm just going to pull out my sword there. And now I need to staunch the flow of blood. I just, I'm not sure. Maybe I'll place my right here. I know. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Shouldn't have pulled the blade out. Idiot. Size a nearby sailor. Was you gain one treasure yeah. and you gain a misfortune token. Oh. Though, which is sad. So that's for you. Thank you. And you gain one of these. A misfortune token works very similar to disadvantage in Dungeons and Dragons in that you will roll your uh, check dice twice the next time you're asked to do any kind of check and you take the lowest value. But I think you can still spend re-roll tokens on that. Thank you. Continue. Uh, now we reduce the hull, crew or supplies by X, which is the total of uh, dial two. So we're going to reduce it by two. The highest infamy player also moves the ship one space and read the list, the entry list on the ship's new space. So, what are we going to reduce? Uh, I got a sack of potatoes. <gasps> <laughs> discard, discard to gain uh, brawn Ooh. or supplies two. Brawn mm. one. Brawn one. Supplies, supplies two. two. Mm. Okay, what are we going to reduce? We've got supplies. Yeah. And we've got ways to get new supplies. Yeah. A couple of people have that, so we can yeah. just do some supplies, two supplies. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And then our highest infamy player, Dr. Bones. Uh, well, we did very well Dr. after that. Bones, Dr. Bones, Dr. Bones, calling Dr. Bones, Dr. Bones, Dr. Bones, Dr. Bones, Dr. Bones, where are we going? It's actually Dr. <laughs> Dr. Skullface. <laughs> Dr. Yeah. Skullface, Dr. Skullface. Um, Doesn't work quite as well no. Dr. Skullface. with the aqua song. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, well, it's just it's just the way my surname is. You don't get to choose your surname, do you? It's just <laughs> ironic you know, coincidence that I'm, I have a skull for a face. Um, should we sail into the rest of the new fog? I think we, I think should. we probably should. Yeah, yeah. I feel like we're, we're in a great position here. We've got the mega cannon, the acid reflux. We've got um, yeah, we've got we've got cigarettes. We, we've got cig- the hull's <laughs> looking really good. Thank you. Um, we've got we've got crew it's for fine. days. So we're going here. Oh. Yeah. Fog. Zero eighty. Fog. 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 <laughs> I do. I do have my bassoon. I could make a really good fog oh. horn. So. Oh. <laughs> I love how we've got okay. cigarettes on on lookout. Fog. Fog. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. Fog. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you approach an unexplainable shape on the horizon and see Ooh. it sink beneath. The waves. Oh no. Its strange shape, briefly glimpsed, is disquieting as it suggests the presence of a creature of enormous size. It's a Kraken. <gasps> Fucking albatross again. <laughs> Many among the crew begin muttering prayers. The waves grow larger soon after that, and before you know it, the ship is being tossed about along the edge of a large storm. And you are not alone. A royal frigate, also battling the waves, is drawn to your location. All fear of the strange shape is lost as your crew bravely prepares for a fight. Remove navigation token 018 from the game. All players gain re-roll one. That's really good. Beautiful. Uh, Let's go with a Kraken or a Leviathan or something. Thank you. Oh, it just be lovely. You. Voluptuous One woman. For me. <laughs> a giant sea wow. lady. And then. Sea lady. A giant sea lady. We turn to page 55. Sea mother. Surprise! Whoa. Uh, it's that again. That's for you. That's for you. Thank you. For you. For you. For you. Is Hawkeye written on the ship's log? No, no it is not. Set dial A to seven. No. Oh. Bom, and bom. dial B to four. Oh, so the sails are fucked. So we can. Oh, uh, Mega Cannon yeah. will get rid of those sails in no time. Yeah. Oh my god. Right? Let's mm. get them. Yeah, Let's get them. I'm going to rally the crew this time. Oh. Okay. okay. Uh, um, Ellen. Uh, I think I am going to gather debris. Mm-hmm. I think. Uh, Lorna. Could I, uh, do, oh, we don't want to escape, do we? No. So I'll fire a cannon then, shall I? Okay. Okay. That's great. I'll load a cannon. Uh, okay. In that case, I will also fire. Great. Okay. Smart. Done. Done. So we rally the crew first. Rally the rally crew. Rally the crew. Gain one swagger. 
gain a swagger. It also gives me a constellation prize. <laughs> Did you get a token? Yeah. You get a token. Yeah, become a thing. Look at yeah. <laughs> Very good. <coughs> we have not uh, one for a while. Then you perform a swagger check. <laughs> oh, well, now brace yourselves, guys, because my swagger is absolutely mad. Uh, maybe not on here, but I've got is loads of this time. That's mine. Get away. <laughs> yeah. Get off me, cigarettes! Yeah. <laughs> Stop leaving your butts everywhere. Okay, I've rolled a two, but it's not the end of the world. So that would you can end use up. Your re -roll. I could use a reroll. I've got three of them, so I will use one. Oh. That's a one. Oh, okay. oh shit! Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna reroll again. Uh, yeah, all right. Again. Come on. Come on. <laughs> That's a five. That's a five. Okay, but, it's but, better. but, but, plus one is six, plus seven, eight. Eight. Beautiful. Choose one rally option. Oh no, hang on, a bit more. Choose two rally options from below on an eight. You can re you can gain a reroll. Mm -hmm. uh, you can choose it multiple times. You can choose another player and they gain a skill of your choice. Uh, you can Ooh. choose another player. That player gains reroll plus two, or I you can reduce either dial by one. So you we could you could reduce the dial once mm -hmm. and gain something. Well, I'll definitely take my reroll back. Yep, very good. Would anyone like a skill? <laughs> uh, I'd love a skill. Yeah? Yeah. What would you want? Hunting. In that case, I shall give you navigation. No, you can have hunting. <laughs> <laughs> Very much. There we go. Nice. Hunting. Nice. And I get this, and I get a constellation Yay. prize. Yay. OK, so I choose two of the following. I can spend one supplies to flip one cannon from its unloaded side to its loaded side. Uh, I can gain infamy. I can gain a reroll token. I think we should spend a supply and load a uh -huh. cannon. Because mm -hmm. um, it might be useful later. I don't think we need to necessarily use it now, but let's uh, get one of the level two ones done. Yeah. Because we can use that yeah. rather than using the big boy. Um, and then I'm going to gain one infamy. Whoa. You have so many reroll tokens. Yeah. You're swimming on them. Swimming on them. Swimming on them. <laughs> uh, Lorna. Yes. Fire the cannons. You gain in one aim. And there's a star, which means I get a little consolation prize. Oh, we're all getting consolation prizes. Level up. Yeah. And then uh, you can choose a target. You can either choose the enemy hull, which is A, which is on seven, or you can choose the enemy sails, which is on four oh. currently. Should I do this one? That's unloaded. That's a, oh. What, you can okay. just roll. That was the only wrong choice. <laughs> 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 I reckon do this one. That first, one. Yeah. Because yeah. then if we if we end up with a loaded mega cannon, that's always useful. Yeah. yeah. So, so we've got plus five. Plus so five. plus five, and then make an aim roll. And I'm going for that hull, right? Mm, no, oh, there sales. is sails. 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 Yeah, sales. I mean, sales is easier, but then we have to go on deck and fight them. Uh, mm. so I'm going for hull. It's up to you. From hull to hull. Hull to hull. Hull and back. Eleven. Eleven. Oh. Plus, yeah. fi plus uh, five from that, which is 16, plus whatever your aim is. One. 17. So reduce the target dial by two, and you gain one in for me. So you want to oh, reduce dial A? Oh by two, yeah. Okay. Grub, you're also I mean, on the cannons. Gain an aim. Great. Uh, can I have a consolation prize, consolation please? Consolation prize for you. Thank you. Um, okay, I guess we're going for a hole then. So, should we Are you using use the mega the, Should we use the mega cannon? Oh. Yeah, might. We can always yeah. load it again next Fire time. Fire acid reflux. <laughs> so, <laughs> so how much? How much uh, additional does that give me? Plus nine. Plus, Plus nine. nine. Holy yep. cow! Okay, here we go. Mm, it's five, six, 14. 15. You want to end up at 18, basically, 18. if you can. I'm going to do a reroll. Mm -hmm. I've got so many rerolls on this one. Okay. That's worse. Reroll. Oh, wow. <laughs> really wants to. Come on. Spoilers. 10. Ten. Ten. That's yeah, what we're talking about. Okay, stuff. so it's a. Plus nine is 18. A, uh, plus another one. So yeah, it's 19. 19 plus. Yeah, it's 20. You've got the best you can get. So oh. minus three to their hull. Yes. A, is that? Yeah, A. One, and two. plus three infamy for Grub. <gasps> Whoa. Whoa. Oh, one, yeah. two. Three. I used acid reflux. <laughs> <laughs> As a chef, I know so much about it. Yeah. <laughs> Those sails are looking very bloated. <laughs> They're going to need a big Gaviscon. They're going to need a big good shit Gaviscon. Gaviscon. <laughs> Captain Gaviscon. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to need a bigger throat. Um, hey. <laughs> hey. 
<laughs> Jill, Jill is putting, uh, swallowing a big Gabascon. Uh, I actually didn't get it. <laughs> <laughs> in, that sea, in a sea it. setting, I thought it would. I thought it was good. I liked it. I thought it would land. Surely, joke of the day. Come on. Thank you. But <laughs> 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 they're always good when they're asked for. Everyone, everyone laugh. Everyone <laughs> laugh. <laughs> the joke of the day. There you go. Put the, put the graphic up. Yeah. <laughs> just, you know what? Just pin a, pin a graphic to Dom, James. Yeah. <laughs> it just says face. joke No, because that makes it sound like I'm no, the no, joke. No, he asked for a joke of the day, but give him a pin. Don't you yeah. dare, James. Pin pad. Get you. <laughs> <laughs> right, uh, and finally, Ellen, you are gathering debris. Mm -hmm. uh, you gain hunting plus one. Great. Lovely. Uh, and then you perform a hunting check. Cool. Get this joke of the day off me. <laughs> Get it off. Oh, Ooh, 10, 10 plus 2, 12. On a 12, nice. uh, you gather, you get, you choose three <laughs> options. You can gain supplies, you can gain a treasure, or you can gain a reroll. You can gain supplies and reroll multiple times. Oh, mm -hmm. okay, so is, is it just treasure? You gain one treasure, you can gain any number of supplies using your three options, and you can uh -huh. gain any number of reroll using your three options. So. Mm -hmm. Maybe I get some supplies mm -hmm. then to help because we're gonna, gonna yeah, One? some supplies. You can choose. You can choose. You've got three choices. So, so you, can, you can have treasure, you can have supplies, and you can have a reroll, or you can have treasure, two supplies, treasure, two rerolls, all three rerolls, all three supplies. Okay, so I'll have so two. Far I'll one. I'll go two, and two? then I'm gonna get treasure. That makes sense. <gasps> nice. Oh, I've got treasure map. Um, after burying this card, treasure Ooh. plus one. After gaining the new treasure, you may bury it unless it cannot be buried. Okay. Wow. Did the ship move this round? No. no. Is dial at zero? No. no. Is dial B at zero? No. no. They attack! Ah. Roll the die! Ah. Um, I mean, it's kind of cocked, but it is a one. Like it was like the tiniest bit cocked. I'm gonna let you be the judge of that. Oh, that's a one. We'll okay. take it. One. One. Reduce the whole uh, crew and or supplies by a total of two. The uh, hull can go down. Can supplies lose. can go down. Yeah. Do one from each. One from yeah. each. One from each. Uh, begin a new round on this page. Done. Okay. Uh, we'll take your things back. Oh. Uh, Come on, baby girl. Hey. Thank you. Come on, baby girl. Call me that. It's a little nickname for you. Thank you. Okay. I'm only a little grub. I don't have any arms. Bosun, start us off. Uh, starting with Dom. Uh, I could, I could, I could rally the crew again, couldn't I? You could. I don't know if that benefits us. Yeah. Why, why not? Okay. Why not? I'm gonna load some cannons. Great. Um, I am going to gather some more debris. Nice. Lorna. <laughs> Should I be doing some firing? You can do some firing. Yeah. yeah. I'm going to do not? some firing as well. Yeah, come so I gain some, same, gain some aim. Okay. Pew. Nice. Right, swagger. Rally the crew, gain one swagger, and then perform a swagger check. Right. That's a two, that's four. Uh, five, six, I might re-roll it, to be honest. I yep. might re-roll it. Um, might re-roll it. <laughs> Maybe not. Might re-roll it, might not. Oh. Chances of getting a one are much... Yeah, 11. 11 nice. plus 12, 13, 14, 15. 15, why can't I see it? Why can't I? 11 plus. Yeah, Choose 15. three options. Choose three options. Holy mackerel, I'll get my re-roll back. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> absolutely. One. Um, Choose another player to gain a skill of your choice. Uh, you can, can I have a skill? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> what do you want? Can I have exploration, sir? Yeah. Yes. Thank you, sir. So, uh, a screw. <laughs> a screw. <laughs> <laughs> um, and I think let's. Uh, could reduce the hole by one. I could reduce the hole by one. Let's do that. Yeah. Yeah. Then we only need to hit it for one. Nice. Grab. <laughs> Load oh, them cannons, yes. Grub. I don't know Choose why my voice following. has changed so drastically. <laughs> uh, uh, Grub has aged rapidly. <laughs> I think Grub's turning into a fly. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, OK, Grub, uh, you can spend one supply to flip one cannon from its unloaded side to yes. its loaded side. OK, the big one. Big one. Flip. Yeah. Uh, and then you can gain infamy or you can <gasps> gain a reroll. 
I don't want to make the decisions. I'll take a reroll, please. Take a reroll. <laughs> <laughs> grub, grub, Thanks. grub knows their place. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've got my fake gun. Buzzing around the top, but never quite there. <laughs> okay, uh, going to do we are now end? going to move on to fire the cannons, and it's Lorna first. Uh, Lorna, you gain aim, aim plus one. Yes. Uh, and then you choose a target. Yes. <laughs> yes. So they're both on yeah. one. They're both. Uh, so no, that's on four. Oh. That one's on four. Oh so yeah, yeah, of course it's it's it is. We're trying to sync them at the moment. In so Esperanto, a four is a one. Yeah. Of course. Right. Uh, exactly. <laughs> so and, a, and a one is a four. It's yeah. difficult. It's yeah. difficult. Yeah. Um, oh well, I'm, should I do that one then? So yeah. So one thing to note is that you're going to have to roll with disadvantage because you've got that misfortune token. Oh, we shit. do need to spend that this turn on the roll. Should I get? I can get rid of that with one of my. Cars? Can I do Ooh, that? Can you do, yes, yeah. if you can get rid of your misfortune, do that absolutely. Yeah, and reroll plus two as well. Oh! oh. Mm. So, great, okay, cool. Mamma mia. Nice. <laughs> That's nice. how we say great in Esperanto. <laughs> <laughs> so, mamma mia. Um, <laughs> um, now okay, now you get to choose uh, a target, so choose. My, That's probably the easiest, yeah. Uh, and then you can choose if you're going to flip over a cannon to add to your roll. You can add plus nine to your roll if you flip over the big one. Big cannon. Piss. Uh, yeah, if you flip over this one, we add plus nine. These ones yeah. are unloaded, so we can't use those. I have to use this one. You mm -hmm. do have to use those? Yep. Well, you don't have to. You don't have to. Yeah. Is it worth do it doing it? I mean, it basically guarantees that we're going to sink them this turn. Yeah. So you might as yeah. well. Yeah. Done. Done. <laughs> okay. Uh, with that said, you need to just roll your die. Oh. Five plus nine is fourteen plus your aim, which is two. Two, so sixteen. Mm. On a sixteen, we reduce the targeted die by two, and you gain one infamy. Ooh. Nice. Now zero. Oh man! I'm oh, you, you've drastically fallen. Yeah. yeah. Crash. What's Because I tried to escape that one and time. And with then, that yeah. said, with that, as the ship begins to sink, I say, "Fire the cannons again!" <laughs> <laughs> and I'm going to gain one aim. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Mostly I did to fill in one of the constellations yep. on here. That's fair. Mm -hmm. um, and then I get to target, I'll target the sails, why not? Kick a man when he's down, mm -hmm. no loaded cannons, doesn't really matter. Uh, on a nine, we reduce the targeted dial by one. Great. Here we go, yay. I didn't gain any infamy. That's okay. But I got my constellation. <laughs> I'm doing my star signs, leave me alone. <laughs> <laughs> right, and Ellen, you mm -hmm. are going to gather the debris again. You're going yeah. hunting plus one. Great. Oh, and that means I get another <gasps> little token. Yeah. 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 All right. Okay, so roll a hunting check. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's a nine plus three. Oh, uh, it's 12. Uh, so you get three options. So you get to gain a treasure, uh, you can gain as many supplies as you want, and as many reroll tokens in. in that three combination. You can only have one treasure though. Okay. Uh, so I'll get one. So I can get one treasure and some. You get yeah one treasure and supplies and a reroll token, or one treasure, two supplies, or okay. one treasure, two reroll tokens. Okay. I'm gonna go one treasure. So um, if you if you gain a treasure, you have to swap it now because you've got four. Oh no, that's just mean. That's making someone else change their mind. So that's fine. I don't okay. even want that. Well, we one. gain supplies for um, that being discarded. Oh, yeah. How many? One supply one. for the treasure being discarded. Nice. And yeah. then Ellen's got two more choices. Okay, so uh, gain that mm -hmm. and I would like a reroll. Yes. Nice. Smart. Thank Wonderful. You. Did the ship move this round? Yar. Is die at zero? Yar. Yar. Uh, <laughs> Let us aboard, cries the enemy crew as their boat sinks, but you all grunt <laughs> in disapproval. <laughs> we have booze, <laughs> they cry. Welcome Ooh. aboard. <laughs> we gain two crew. Yay! Oh, nice. Huge. Uh, a small mouse to feed. Mm. Uh, the highest infamy player moves the ship one space. Is it still me? It's still, still you. you. Oh, we going into time to go seven, into seven. the fog. It's time to go into the fog. Oh, exciting. We're all agreed fog. on that. Oh. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, cigarettes. Thank you, cigarettes. Um, okay. Uh, this so we're going in here. This was brought to you by mm. cigarettes. Um, <laughs> it's oh, rocks. It's rocks. Oh, no. oh, oh, shit. It over. Rocks. Is clearing stone written on the ship's log? No, it is not. Oh no. No. It's your first time visiting the ocean's edge. Yes. yes. Yeah. You stare out into the moonlit waters ahead, watching as you creep closer to the ocean's edge. <clears throat> the captain walks up next to you, taking an interest in the somber look on your face. What's going on, me matey? He asks. Captain, you respond meekly. 
Do you really think we're going to sail past the ocean's edge? I mean, how do you know the stone is going to work? Every crew that ever attempted going deep into that place has never returned. It's the end of the world, Captain. The captain stops you by putting a hand on your shoulder. Settle down, me matey. Settle down. It's all gonna be all right. But how do you know? You respond, unconvinced. The captain looks straight into your eyes, a move that makes you uneasy. The joy and wild exuberance that usually lies within his gaze fades into a calm and steady stare that pierces you. I don't, he responds. I don't know if it'll work. I don't know if I'm leading us all to the depths of Davy Jones's locker. But I know there has to be more to the world than this. There has been so many clues, so many moments in my life that have told me this place is real. This world that we live in now is broken and you know it. You can feel it in your bones. I want to see it whole again. Captain pushes a tin cup of rum into your hands. Yeah. Now, have a drink and enjoy yourself, <laughs> me matey. We're still alive, aren't we? And that's worth celebrating. Am I? <laughs> <laughs> you sip your drink and let out a small chuckle. To the ocean's edge, I guess. Hole minus one. Oh, <laughs> All crash. players get one re-roll and okay. we turn to page 15. A little bit of re-roll. Mm. That's nice, isn't it? Yeah. Exciting. Got loads of everyone's got loads of free rolls. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Too many. Thank you. Thank you. Cursed water. <laughs> Doesn't look good for us. No. Uh, we're going to check the threat. We do not have the threat, Ooh, which is good. So on this one, we've got red uh, boxes, which means they have to be done. We have to have. We have to feed the hungry crew, and we have to sail. Uh, but in the meantime, we can do a bunch of other stuff. Um, we can gaze into the abyss. <laughs> Joy. We can visit mm -hmm. the ship graveyard. Ah. We can comfort the crew. There. there. Oh. We can ready <laughs> the cannons, or we can visit the captain in his mad old quarters. Mm. Bosun. Right. Thank you. On your marks, get set, go. Oh, sail. Uh, gaze. Oh, I wanted a gaze. <laughs> 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 Oh, there's a bloody captain. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I'll do the hungry crew then. <laughs> Done. Hungry nice crew. Nice job, team. <laughs> uh, hungry like the crew. <laughs> <laughs> we would have to spend five supplies to feed the crew now. Ah. But people have discards that get us supplies, don't mm -hmm. they? Mm. So I think that's actually worth doing because we... Okay. The discontent goes down. Otherwise, the discontent's going up to here. Yeah, no, that's bad. We don't. Well, we've got that. loads. Of, we've got, we have loads of space. We could just let them go hungry. Uh. But then I personally lose an infamy. <gasps> I mean, you're already as low as you can get, so yeah. it doesn't really mean anything. It means a lot to rear out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it means so much. Really we'll feed the crew. Oh, okay. we're feeding them. Yes. All right. Somebody else One, fix that two, problem. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Please uh, fix We lose it. a discontent, and I gain an infamy because they love Admiral Cheeks. Oh no! <laughs> so everything's gone down. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It's uh, okay, now you have a chance to do this. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. It's my redemption story. Gazing into the abyss is Grub. <laughs> exploration plus one. <laughs> uh, great. Then perform an exploration check. <laughs> okay, here we go. That's a eight. Eight. Uh, two, seven, nine, Dom. <gasps> oh, exciting. You stare downward into the swirling black waters and the waters part as if repelled by your gaze. <laughs> downward and downward you peer. The ocean here is shallow, but oddly, your vision pierces vast depths of black waters as if you sailed above the ocean's deepest point. And there in the depths you see him. A rotting king chained to an anchor of cold iron. He looks up at you, the eyes long absent from his skull, and he howls in anger. Um, uh, oh, and he howls in anger. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> hell? Um, um. Boss, asks Larry the Lout, pulling you from the vision. You okay? Yeah, yeah, you say. Just yeah. think it. <laughs> Misfortune. Plus one. No! Lock. Gross. Action two. Oh. Thanks. Enjoy that. 
Ew. So that means on the next uh, ability check, you have to roll with disadvantage. Yeah. Mm. Uh, well, that was that was bleak. That was really mm -hmm. bad. Yeah. Hey, that was so bad. Well, Ellen's visiting the ship graveyard now, so we'll see oh, how that goes. Yay. Hunting plus one. <laughs> no. Yay. You get to fill in a little thing on my constellation. Lovely. Uh, and then you make a check. Love it. Okay. 12! Oh yeah, plus God. hunting. Plus four is... 16. 16. Two okay, eight. two, eight, one. This is the best one that you can get. Shouldn't we get a cut of the loot? <laughs> Asks one of the crew angrily. <laughs> Right you are, you agree. But since there's not enough for even divide amongst us all, I'll hold on to it in the meantime. The fool smiles amicably at this and gets back to work. Infamy, this is a redemption arc, plus three. Yes! Oh, there you are. Cheeks. <laughs> treasure plus two as well. Yes, okay, right. Oh, and when, when you discard the treasure, we gain supplies. Yes, mm. great. Um, good. great, okay. Okay. So, oh, discard to gain plus two on supplies or hull. This one, do we want to up the hull a little yeah. bit? Or yeah, so you have to discard one to keep that one, to and keep then that discard one. that one. Ah, to okay, use its okay, power, okay. You know okay. I mean? Well, um, I, I think discontent we're okay, so I'm gonna get rid of that one. So we gain supplies for that. So Whoa. by one. Great. Um, so I'm gonna keep that one. That yeah. One. Cool. Yeah. So Great. that's another supplies. Is the hull yeah. going up? No. Supplies. No. Yeah. No. But I've now got one that I can uh, go the have the hull or supplies go up. Ooh. Nice. So oh. yeah, okay. lock action three. And I've got a magnetic spot, a, a magnetic stone spoon. What's a spoon? <laughs> uh, I'd explain the science behind it, but you wouldn't understand. Mm. 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 I you can use that to find north. It yeah. helps me with navigation and aim. Mm. Oh, cool. Mm. Very cool. Hey. It points at the enemies. Yeah. <laughs> there. <laughs> it's it's, 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 yeah, it's, it's auto enough. aim. It's yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Captain's quarters. Uh, we fill in the next captain quarters box on the ship log. We've done that for a while. Mm. And we read the entry that is there. Read entry 043. Begging pardon, Captain, you say, knocking on the door to his quarters. I was hoping I could speak to you about this sailing past the ocean edge business. <gasps> no. Some of the crew be worried, Captain. <laughs> I'll stop you right there, me matey, he interrupts. Vance points to a group of books lying on the table. All these I swiped from the Mont family when I was a boy. Oh, that's the same family as the, the mm. one that was in the thing. They speak of the land of sunset, a world of un unimaginable riches and magic. And everyone shares such similarities that I'm convinced they ain't just coincidence. <gasps> but how do you know they aren't ain't just stories, Captain? The captain sighs as if he has explained this all before. <laughs> I tell you what, me matey, you settle the crew down a bit and I'll fill you in on some more once we have a moment to rest up on land. You nod and walk away feeling no better, but you still do your best to calm the crew. Discontent minus one. Oh. Gain one skill of your choice. Yes. This is the plot line to The Beach, the Danny Boyle film, The Beach. <laughs> this is the same, the same film. I'm going to add myself a little navigation. Lovely. Lovely. Okay. Nice. That's me done, guys. Dummy Wombles. Set sail. So I get a navigation, plus one. Lovely. Which gives me another little star there. I'll put that in there. Lovely. Good job, Lee. Nearly there. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I've got a parrot's legs. Uh, and if then. I discard treasure. Do, that's something to do with. Do I get to fill in the thing? Only when you bury it. Only when I bury it. That's it. Sorry. Ignore me. Um, so I'm going to make a navigation check. Mm. Do I get any bonuses on that? No. Oh, no, I do. I do. Plus one, plus one there. Plus two here. So that's plus three. To a four, which is seven. Seven. Um, Infamy minus one. I'm going to re-roll that. Mm. Uh, yeah, very good. <laughs> I'm going to re-roll that as a six. Oh, okay. You would have gained Infamy there, though. Would I? Yeah, you would have got plus one. I mean, you're already at I mean eight to seventeen. Oh, is I thought. Like, yeah, what did I roll before? You rolled a seven exactly. So a seven before would have lost you Infamy, uh, but this one gained you Infamy, and then we oh, yeah, spend supplies to move the ship. Um, Which, because you're not going to roll over an 18 with a 12. Okay, yeah, let's, let's go three. for that. Let's go for that. 
Yeah. Let's go for that. Uh, so infantry plus one does nothing. Uh, spend supplies and or hull to move the ship. We have to spend two to move one space. But is, isn't our goal to get there? Our goal is to get that one so space. So. But you can't. We can't go through here, can we? Because it's rocks. Uh, no, we can go through. We can go here. That We're, at the ocean's down. Edge. We're at the ocean's edge, so we can sail down. Oh, right, I see. Yeah. I thought if it was rocks, you had to. Oh, we don't flip it. Yeah, we're going to this one. So. Ah, I see, I see, I understand, I comprehend. In that case, let's 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 yeah. reach our destination. Mm-hmm. With supplies? I guess so. Ooh, we can spend, yeah. we've got things that get supplies back, yeah, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Great. Yeah, cool. Okay, we're going to go here. Oh, <gasps> fantastic. Ah, oh, my God. Round end. Yar. Threat plus one. Uh-oh. Uh starting with the player with the highest infamy and proceeding clockwise, each player with one or more constellation event tokens must resolve <gasps> their constellation hey. event. Fantastic. Right. So everyone, please fill yours in. Here we go. Right. I'm going to start with Dom and go round the table this way for everyone who mm -hmm. has filled in a constellation event. I met a mystic named Bonzo the Indifferent. <laughs> He was badly starved, and I couldn't just leave him behind. I offered him bed and board if he joined us, and he accepted. I hope he likes being a pirate. Surely his mystical know-how will come in handy. Crew plus one, infamy plus one. Mm. There's nothing <laughs> for anything. Yep. Yep. <laughs> yep. Useless. <laughs> Fantastic. Great. 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 I mean, same. Very yeah. good. Um, so mine is... I buried the shiny Charizard Pokemon cards, <laughs> just as they told me to, <laughs> marking the spot with an X so I'd remember where. I'm not quite sure what the point of it was. It doesn't seem <laughs> to make much sense to collect it, only to throw it in a hole on some random island I doubt I'll ever visit again. Oh well, doesn't matter much anyway. Numerous possessions will likely get me stabbed or robbed on this ship. Gain one reroll, gain one skill. Of your choice. Oh. Okay. Gonna gain a skill that immediately gets me a token. I'm gonna gain some exploration. Do you get to then fill out do your next constellation? No, I don't get I don't get another token, I'm just filling out to like oh, I I get cool. another bit of my constellation. I can't believe it. Another survivor like me. For so long I thought I was the only one, but here she is. She doesn't need, remember how she escaped, but she does remember our home, even if her name is Jane, a cursed and vile name among my people. Context, Jane is one of our Rogue's Venture cast ah. members. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, oh, Incredible. Name, Jane. Incredible. Right. <laughs> <laughs> it still feels good to discuss old times over on Ox Venture. Plug. <laughs> <laughs> I can't remember the last time I felt so, felt so complete. Oh, that's Aww. nice. Jane, you complete me. <laughs> it's so a very mean. special episode. Um, okay, uh, yeah. I, sorry. Oh, yeah. Plus crew, one minus one discontent, so no shame. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Yay. Nice. All right. Um, I got two this time, so. It was Rose from the Waves' birthday, so I whipped up a little cake for the crew to enjoy. The candles only took a few seconds to ignite. The black powder baked into the icing and triggered an explosion. <laughs> I thought it would blow a hole in the ship so I could dive out of it. But instead, it just removed the eyebrows of everyone in attendance. Back to the drawing board. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we get three supplies. Wow. The captain decided to raise our spirits with a cooking competition for the crew to show off their uh, cooking abilities. It generated a lot of buzz throughout the ship. The captain gave me a little bonus for being a judge. I voted for the spinach dish <laughs> since it seemed the most undercooked and likely to kill everyone. <laughs> uh, I get a treasure. Um, and choose another player to gain a treasure. Who doesn't have a ton of treasure? Me. Oh, you don't. Go for it. Have a treasure. Thank you. I got a big boy's musket. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> Upgrade from the fake gun. Yeah. Uh, before performing a brawn check, you may spend one supply to add four to your results. Ooh. I've got a barrel of tar, which I imagine I took from heaving up my lungs from yes. my cigarettes. <laughs> yes. Discard to gain health. Yeah. To gain hull. Yeah. Great. Oh. Cool. Precious hull. Yeah. Precious, precious, precious hull. Um, okay, cigarettes. That's why we put you in charge of the hull, because you can just cough up tar. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> Somebody squeeze cigarettes over that. <laughs> <laughs> oh. 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 Okay. Come on, cigarettes. What happened to old cigarettes then? Old, <laughs> cigarettes. Uh, old Finn gave me some sweet ink on my back to commemorate my beloved. Or well, that's what he says. It is, after all, on my back. <laughs> <laughs> Retrieve card 77, sweetheart tattoo from the story deck. Oh my god. Oh. Story deck, which you haven't even used. No, 77. No. Oh, thank you. <laughs> so this gives me. Uh, I'll. Oh, sweetheart tattoo. I'll fill in the name once I actually know it. Oh, Jesus. Oh. You're uh, so sad. <laughs> to, uh, no wonder why I smoke so much. Minus two navigation, <laughs> plus two cannon, and plus Can two on. the little fish. the little fish guy hunting. Oh, okay. so it makes you bad at navigation, but it's good at everything else. Yeah. Wow. Good okay. Cool. Good so basically, it's, it's made you less focused, but full of rage. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm violent. gonna get a name. I'm gonna get a name. <laughs> More violent and hunting and stuff mm. all over the shop. Cool. All right. right. Did the ship move this round? Yar. What's the new entry on the ship's space? Nine, six, three. Yar. Have you already visited this island? Nar. Nar. Oh my god. Oh no. <clears throat> you arrive on Precipice Island. Mm. You see before you a collection of small houses nestled into the cliff's edge that overlooks the ocean. You hear a distant rumbling of the watery barrier that, ma that marks the ocean's edge. And you wonder, who would choose to live in such a place? You follow Captain Vance to a rickety old bridge that leads to one of the cliffside houses. Been a long time, me mateys, but I always loved coming here, he says. The house itself is a crumbling structure made of mismatched parts. You notice a lovely golden telescope reaching out past a hole in the roof, star staring up at the dark sky. The captain removes his hat and licking the palm of his hand, tries to smooth down his great white tangle of hair. When he reaches the door, he gives a nervous knock. The door opens to an old woman whose body and clothing seem to keep with the rest of the house's theme. JJ, she exclaims. <laughs> Just with Vance, get your butt over here! And the two give each other a happy embrace. You learn her name is Esmeralda, and she is quickly able to decipher the map. Red Rock Island, the Painted Caverns, she instructs. That's where you'll be finding that stone. When you leave a half hour later, bellies warm with tea, Esmeralda grabs one of you by the arm and whispers, Take care of him. And you can see she looks scared. He's dreamed of this forever. Never enough in this world to keep him happy, keep him satisfied. But it's dangerous. A person who plums the abyss too long will never truly make it back out. You remember that. You leave Esmeralda's home, happy to find that the captain hasn't led you astray, but concerned that the mission you are on is becoming all the more real. Return all revealed navigation tokens face down to the pile. Write painted caverns on the ship's log. Ooh. Remove all threat from the threat track. Ooh. Painted caverns? Painted caverns. Did I have to write something else on this log beforehand? No, no. I don't think so. Right. Just checking. Ooh. I really didn't do okay. my job. <laughs> find out what we're supposed to be doing and then... So this is the end of part one. It says, congratulations, you have reached the end of part one. The highest infamy player chooses two of the following. We can gain supplies plus three, discontent minus one, crew plus three, or hull plus three. We've got max and we've got, so it's probably just hull and supplies. We'll have the hull. Yeah. We've always been proud yeah. of our big hull. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that right, cigarettes? Yeah. <laughs> it's the biggest hull in all of... Es Esperanta. <laughs> <laughs> and we gain three supplies. And three supplies. Yeah, and we gain three supplies. Very nice. <laughs> <laughs> and that's what we're going to be calling it. I don't want to spoil any more for you, and also we've been playing this for bloody ages. <laughs> <laughs> so maybe we'll come back to this another time, who knows? Oh. Uh, but that was really fun. Yeah. I loved it. Yeah, that was really great. It's, it's such so a good fun. Game. It's great. It's yeah. a great game.
And it's the plot of the beach by Danny and Boyle. The, and it's the plot of the beach <laughs> by Danny Boyle. And Tusk for a moment. Which there was, was yeah, like, when I really slapped him a walrus. Yeah. 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 <laughs> how, how would you slap a walrus, sorry? Okay, yeah, cool, that's what I thought. All right. Which part of it? I don't know. <laughs> oh, no, okay. Let's it's the split out yeah, and then it. Like... I, don't like, I don't like this anymore. Well, let's move. I'm sorry I ever asked. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> On the bum, because you don't want to do the face, because it will get you. So that brings this episode of Board Game Club to an end. Thank you so much for watching. As ever, if you want to see more uncut episodes of Board Game Club, join us on Patreon, patreon.com forward slash no rolls barred. Hey, Lorna, tell people where they can find you if they want to check out your stuff. Uh, I'm on Instagram at InstaLawns. Wonderful. <laughs> Great. And elsewhere. And Ellen. Where can they find you? Uh, you can find uh, me with my friends over at Oxventure on YouTube and also Outside Extra and Outside Xbox. Wonderful. Check out Oxventure to see more RPG content and also check out our RPG channel, Chaotic Neutral, which has just launched like last week. Oh, I think we've got a so fiasco exciting. episode over there for you to watch right now. And we have D&D coming later in the month. So again, a refresher. Check out Lorna, check out Oxventure, check out Chaotic Neutral. Check out Dom's stuff, but this version of Dom's going to die at the end of the day. We'll get a new one for next shoot, so don't worry too much about that. And join us next week on Board Game Club, where we're going to be playing Saboteur. We will see you then. Three, two, one. Get on board!